Wait. Okay, device is connected. Now let me make sure that thingy is actually connected. Uh, there it is. Yay. Fuck. Oh, wait, no. Yay. <laughs> Is it? No, it's not loud. I don't really wear my headphones today. I was making an animatic, so I've had them on for a good minute. I'm trying to figure out a schedule of how I want my stuff to be uploaded now. So I was like, I don't really make a lot. But I do want to try to have some type of schedule when I do upload. So like, oh yeah, you do upload sometime on um, Friday. I don't know. I'm like half awake right now. I start I started playing Coral Island last night. Well, I had to restart my thing because I have not been playing it for a while. So, well, let me make sure my shit's correct. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Now we can start playing. Just doing a quick rundown of everything. But yeah, my my hand doesn't bother me, but I, whatever I I try to space out when it comes to making it and Mac and then making full pieces. Cause um I burn myself out very quickly. And I don't like that, so I try not to do that. I try not to burn myself out. I wonder if that mod is gonna work. I put in more Yandere mods. <laughs> Cause I was like, now I kinda wanna see what it would feel like if ev literally everyone in this fucking town is Yandere. I don't think there's a Yandere Maru mod, which is kinda sad. Oh, I actually kinda like her. I might give her something for her birthday today. Oh, I don't think I have anything that she would like unless I go run and get some coffee. If Gus is gonna be at his thing today. Um. Fuck. Is there anything good I can give that lady? Cause I could, I could also go. Oh shit. Hello, Puddles. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? Oh, God. It reminds me of when we first met. Simply thinking about it made me want to see you so badly all of a sudden. Elliot. Elliot, please. I literally have a man that I'm planning on marrying. Well, I must admit, it wasn't just on a whim that I wanted to meet you here. I've actually been wanting to tell you this for a long time. Elliot. Elliot, no. Chill the fuck out. No. <laughs> Despite having prepared for this moment, I still am feeling a little nervous. Oh god, no. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill me. Once you meet the person who's going to change your life, you simply know it's he right away. He's gonna murder me. I'm gonna tell him no and he's gonna kill me. And for me, you are that special person. Oh my god, no. Elliot, no. It's no. No, please. Get off my farm. I love you, Puddles. Oh my god, no. Not straight to I love you. Not I like you or nothing. Not even I, I not even I like you. I could have Oh my god. 
you can't imagine how much I really love you. Every second I'm with you, I'm restraining myself, and I don't want my feelings to scare you. <laughs> oh my god, Elliot. Elliot, I'm very scared. I'm very fucking scared. But now, I just can't hold back any longer. Elliot, what are you gonna do? Elliot, please get off my lawn. I can't imagine you with anyone else. Oh no, he's gonna kill my man. He's gonna kill Sterling. I can't imagine you. I can't imagine you with anyone else. Whenever I see you smiling at other people, it, may, it pains me. Elliot, I literally have a man. I literally have a man. I want you to reserve that heavenly smile only for me. I want you to stay by my side. Elliot. Elliot. <laughs> me to do something anything at all i would do it for you without question will you get the fuck off my lawn then <laughs> get off my lawn please leave i have a man oh my god don't get closer i want you to be my alone elliot 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 please elliot oh no uh. Puddles, will you be my girlfriend? This is so sudden, I have to think about it. Elliot, you're scaring me. Elliot, you are scaring me. But what if I say that and he's like, oh, I'm scaring you, and he pulls out a fucking machete. <laughs> this is too early. We just started. It's only seven, it's only been seven minutes. Oh my God, what the fuck? I don't want to think about it. I have a man. I want to marry- I want to marry Sterling! Oh my god, Elliot, you're scaring me. You really are. I'm sorry, Puddles, I just- oh god, don't make me- don't- I uh, know. Don't be afraid of me, okay? You can still think of me as your best friend. No matter what happens, believe me when I say I will never hurt you. I don't believe that for a second, <laughs> but- I won't give up. No, give up. I won't stop loving you. No, stop loving me. <laughs> see, so, see you later, Puddles. Oh my god. Get off my lawn. I'm gonna lock my door tonight. You're scaring all of us, Elliot. Hey, bitches. Bros and non binary hoes. I'm being, being stalked. Being stalked. My dearest Puddles, I, have, I apologize deeply for the unsettling incident that occurred at my humble abode yesterday. It pains me to witness my mother's, oh God, it's Penny, unpredictable temperate and the distress it may have caused you. Please, in the name of our precious bond, let us erase that unfortunate event from our memories and move forward. I implore, I implore you to forgive and forget as I am determined to shield our love from any disturbances, your fateful penny. Get off my lawn! Why is it? Everyone wants my pharmacy! <laughs> our kind, everyone wants my pharmacy! I just have... To make it worse, I literally just... Oh my god, then Pam's asking for alcohol. <laughs> everyone wants my pharmacy! <laughs> And then I made it get worse. I added more yonder. I added two more yonder mods. I don't know if the Sam one will work, but there's a Har there's a Harvey yonder mod as well. Cause I was like, you know what'd be funny? What if we add more yonder? So it becomes yonder do valley. I'm scared, bro. What mods did you download? I wanted some yonder mods, but now people are trying to eat my. <laughs> They're trying to get up in my coochie. And in my skin, they're trying to fucking- I have a man in this. I literally have a man. My babies! Look at our babies. Come here. Come here, other cow. Good lord, everyone's a yandere in this bitch. Here <laughs> everyone is. It's- everyone's a yandere here. 
I just wanted to, I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to farm. What did you think was going to happen? I don't know. <laughs> I thought they were going to cancel each other out. I thought they wouldn't, I didn't know. I didn't think, I honestly, when I first started using these mods, I did not think they were all going to work at once, but they do. And it's scary that the fact that they all work at once. Oh yeah. Nora wants blueberries. So I'm going to give her these blueberries. Nora is another person that's really cute. She's a, she's normal though. Actually, no, she did say that she was going to put, well, she said she considered putting poison into the thing, but she's still more normal than the other bitches. Yay, red cabbage. I need this. I'm going to put you in there. I don't really need one blueberry. Fuck, I said one blueberry. One blueberry, one tomato. Do I need one? Yeah, I need one of those. And... All right, put a poppy in there so I can keep all that. Oh yeah, and I said I was gonna show y'all why Pierre is a little bitch. So we're also gonna go do that today. I wanna give Nora, wait, let me see if I can make some blueberry tarts. Can I, do I have any stuff to make blueberry tarts? Farm, more like farming bitches. <laughs> My farm is called the horny farm. So it is kind of accurate. This is the horny farm because everyone wants to get up in my coochie. Oh, I don't have any wheat. God damn it, I didn't steal any wheat from Pierre. But she said she likes blueberries, so I'll go give Nora some blueberries. Nora is this beautiful, lovely person that is just so beautiful and lovely, and I would let her step on me. Ew, blueberries. Blueberries are the horny farm. I'm... Today should be a good day for fishing. It's always a good day for fishing. It's actually a better day when it's raining, but you didn't hear that from me. Hi, Pierre. I'm not here to, st I'm here to actually give you back stuff. What if I steal this shit from him later? And he's just like, what the fuck? Puddles just gave me all this shit and now it's all gone. Um, yeah, also all those. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I don't need to buy any of those. Wait, do I need to buy the spangle? I can't remember. Do I need spangles? I'll buy one just in case because I'm not sure if I need them or not. Yeah, I have everything else. But yeah, so dude, that's a what, a what a way to start to scream. Elliot at my front door, confessing his love for me, knowing that I have a man. We love that. We love when men scare us. Where is Nora going to be today? Is she it? That's Leah. Leah, okay, she's going to be over there with Leah. So I really want to give her these blueberries. Nora is cute, but if any of those yandere's hurt her, I will fight them. And I, and I met her only a few streams ago. <laughs> exactly. We can. Nora actually competes with. Oh my god, there she is! Oh, farmer, nice to see you. Nice to see you here at the Cinder Snap Forest. Care to join me on this sunny afternoon? Hell yeah. I brought you blueberries. I'm actually out here due to my research, you know, from my PhD. I have some PhD for you. Have you ever heard of the purple-tailed chameleon? I won't be surprised if you haven't. It's a very rare species, and there's actually a sad reason for that. This species is endangered and is very sensitive to environmental changes, and with global warming and pollution, it's slowly disappearing. Aww. They're actually originated from the island called, I'm not even going to try saying that, I'm going to say Ark, and eventually got here. The valley used to be full of them 20 years ago. It was the perfect habitat for them to reproduce and find enough food. However, since Joja came around, things changed a lot. I'm guessing you know why. Yeah, that makes some sense. 
My main goal here is to see if there are still any of them left at this location. If so, I have to, I have to assess how, how many are still here, and what's affecting them the most, and if there's still a way to reverse the situation. You should grow some reefer. Arkine, I don't think I can, I probably, there's probably a mod for that. But I'm not going to. <laughs> every, every time a species becomes extinct, it's like a piece of my planet dies with it. A part of history is lost. Oh my god, I see exactly. Is this how all people with the fucking ADHD feel? Like we hyperfixate something like this, and that's like this is exactly how I feel. It's weird. She's. This is like Jesus. And it's really sad to see that to see that humans are willing to do things they know would damage the planet just for money. Yeah, we do be doing that. Yeah, we do be doing that. It's our job as scientists to do something about it. I would do whatever you want, my queen. Anyway, I should get back to it. One of them might show up at any moment now. Thanks for the company, farmer. I will do whatever you want me to. I will freaking burn down Jojo. What the hell are you doing here? Kiwi is ignoring you. I will kick your little ass. Wait, do you want flowers? Do you like flowers? Kiwi hates this. Kiwi hate puddles. Kiwi stab- What the fuck? This thing tried to st This little fucking small apple is starting to stab me. I gave it a flower and it threatened to murder me. What the- <laughs> Where the fuck is- where, where- where- is she still over here or did she leave? Okay, no, she's down here. Uh, why? Because I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna- what's it called? I'm not gonna look for a reefer mod. Thanks, farmer. You can have all the blueberries you want. I will get you more. Every time we give to the valley, the valley gives back to us. That's why we have to treat it with treat it as nice as we can. It's our job to take care of it. I hope you're doing your part, farmer. I'm cutting I'm cutting down trees, but I, I swear to God, they're gonna they'll come back. They always come back. They're like fucking what's it called? Spring trap. I'll find one for you. Then you put it in your Stardew Valley mod. Your Stardew Valley thing. My mods are mainly, honestly, mainly yandere's and more characters and other things. I don't want to fill up my thing with mods and then once they, because it's going to update again. Trees, we always come back, yeah. Hi, Dusty. The way I talk to him like he's an actual real dog when he's just a bunch of pixels, but shit, he's he's precious to me. Gene and Jorts. Okay, well he shouldn't be. Where the fuck is Sterling? He might be over there at the wait. Wait, where's where's the, where's the other girl? God, there's so many bitches in here. <laughs> Was that gonna stop me? Hell no. And damn, why does all my does the mall my mod work? It would be sad if it doesn't. I didn't even try putting it in because I was afraid. I was so afraid of what's it called? Since since the person the person who um was a lot of these mods are old. A lot of these mods are very very old. Lucille, his mod is old. Um, the Ridge mod is still up to date. A lot of the Yandere mods are old. And I try... I was scared to... I, I might just go and add it back in there. Just to see if it would work. Because the All Might mod is also old. I love it, but it's, it's just old, though. But I might add him back in there. Just like, oh, hi, Sterling. Hi. Oh, I can't believe my birthday is already around the corner. Damn. I'm so used to just drinking them away to the city, but I know Henry and, Ma and Maya still want to celebrate it. I want to celebrate it too, you little fucking shit. Yeah, that's the only... I really want to see if my old... What's it called? 
the mod, the old save would work. Because it got, the old save got corrupted. That's why I had to restart. And I didn't know I didn't want to. I mean, y'all were here when I did it. When I had to restart. Because it was basically corrupted. It, it would have, I would have to go in and fuck shit up. Take a lot of things out. Because a lot of the mods are gone. Today's the only day that I'm free. Maddie, I will break your legs. I'm gonna go find the other lady. I know she's around here somewhere. I don't know when she comes down here, but I want to give her something nice on her birthday. I wonder if I could. There was a lot. There was a couple of mods I just had to give up on. Like um, there wasn't. There was a mod called the Janet mod where to add another lady in there that I thought was fucking hilarious. Oh, and the Zuzu City mod. That mod, it's not gone, but th there's some pieces of it that have basically, you have to download other mods for that mod to work, and those mods have not been updated yet. So I'm waiting for that. Oh god, I did not know you did not like, okay, how about this? Oh, Flora seems to be talking to herself. I can't believe Lenny told me to talk. To talk, to talk about myself more. What if I bore the other person or make them mad? Damn, I feel like that too sometimes. Hi, Anton. How's it going? Hope you have a good day. I don't talk to... I might talk to anyone over here. And that's, that's... That's probably a problem. But in my defense, they are pretty far away. And also in my defense... Uh, I have my town is full of yonderies, and the yonders would probably come over here and beat their ass. They'd probably burn this whole town to the ground. I need let me go see the other mod, the yonder, yondery mods are working because I want to make sure that they are. Because if not, then I'll just take them out, keep my folders clean. There's one with Leah, Harvey. I need to see there's one with Maru, but I think there really isn't. Which does kind of make sense. She's not honestly not all that popular. There was a, there was a Sebastian Yandere mod that I have I don't think it's been updated. And the last time I tried using it, it just didn't work at all, which made me sad. What in the world am I going to make for dinner? Cook your child. Let me see where the, these bitches are. Okay, Harvey, you're up. Hi, Philip. I'm really glad the hotel, the gym makes. Okay, yeah. I need to give you more things so that you can give me more dialogue. Hi, Harvey. Hmm, I'm struggling to make ends meet. I don't have enough patience. I guess I should try patience from neighboring towns. No, that's basically his normal stuff. Maybe it's not working. Hi, kitties. There's really nothing like rolling around and covering yourself in a scrunchy smell. I don't know why humans don't do it. I don't mind cleaning jorts. Even when he gets into trash, I like caring for others. So I suppose it's no surprise given that it's my job. Demetrius, stop watching the cats. It's good to take a break from work every now and then. He is such a cold, dead stare. And you know what's wild? There is a... Okay. There is a mod. There is a mod where Haley and I have never downloaded this mod someone else covered it hey where Haley is with the farmer and she had but she has sex with all the men in town for money to keep the house and Demetrius was one of them and Jesus Christ and this is before I even this is before I already hated him but this is just made it worse <laughs> this did not help his case those yonderies would make sure them 
that lefty ride malfunction to the point that it falls. They absolutely would. I need to figure out what... Actually, I know what Harvey likes. I need to get a preserves jar. And make some jam. Into pickles and jam. Yeah, because Harvey likes pickles. I only know that because one person mentioned it in a video. Because I never really care that much to look into it. Now I need to go see if Leah's mod is working. And if Sam's mod is working. It'd be so funny if someone went and disappeared. Hey, it's good to see ya. Maru is so... She's so adorable. I would love for there to be a Yandere mod of her. Wait. Sterling. Sterling is here with Shane. I want to talk to Shane. God. How do you do so many things alone, Angel? Do you know how dangerous that is? I watched you fish for hours the other day. <laughs> we already read this, but he watches me. He watched me fish for hours, and he's like, "What if? So, what if it was not me?" Um, do, do you want something? I want you to keep your uncle away from me. I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. I've been here for m two months, you little shit. Little little bastard. Where the fuck is Leah? She's usually outside of her thing, but maybe she's somewhere else. Oh my god. How the fuck are you? Okay. She's at the beach. That's just wonderful. But I do need to make sure the mod is it is the mods are up and running. Sometimes they conflict with each other. It's not like mods will mods just or what's it called? When they're not, when they're broken, they instantly tell you. I mean, sometimes the game won't, won't run, but... Story, but I haven't had that problem. Hey there, miss. A lot of since since you're here. When you see hot air balloons drifting over to sea, you'll know the summer's in full swing. Okay, well, he's... The mod's not working for him, either. Okay. I figured. I wonder how well Elliot can swim. Do you think he could safely swim out into out? For, uh, fuck. Do you think he could safely swim from out of the waves? I wonder how. Okay, yeah. That's all your Leah. I got something. I got some bad news to tell you about <laughs> Elliot. I don't think he's interested in you, and I really wish that was not the case because he scares me. I should probably, maybe I should fish for a little while. Because I do want to put some cool fish. I do want to put some cool fish in my tank. Oh, fuck, I did not see that. I wish I had my controller. Because then I could feel the vibrations. I won't have to pay too much attention. Oh, I kind of miss the, um... I think it was the expand. Was it the expanded mod that has like more fish? And there's this one fish that I absolutely love. Well, there's two fish. There's the butterfish and there's a puppy. Uh, there's a puppy fish, and it's literally just a puppy, a dogfish, and it's adorable. And the butterfish is just a butterfish. There's nothing really all that special about it. It's just a fish that is in the shape of butter. Yay. I could sell this for a lot of money. Or I could go... Wait, no, it's too late to go rob Pierre. Damn it. Willie... Willie also... He loves super cucumbers. I don't know what he does with them, but he does love them. I'm gonna go to the bar. I think I already spoke to everyone that... Wants to get into my pants today. Hi, Lucille. You keep returning. Let's have no choice. It's supposed to be okay. Yeah, whatever. You're not gonna kill me. I'm like a I'm like a fucking roach. I'm not supposed to have. They told me I'm supposed to have life all figured out. 25 years ago, puddles. Oh, <laughs> how very wrong they were. I still haven't figured a thing out. Man. 
Yeah, I don't I don't know I don't know shit about life either. Stop being a jury maker. Good money, but no dad Dad said my hands are too big and clumsy for that. Uh yeah, I could see that. I wonder if there's a mod to make Clint slightly more slightly worse than he already is. And before you ask, what do you mean by that? Um, let's say you marry, you befriend and you marry Emily first. If you befriend and marry Emily, and then you befriend um, Clint, he will still try to hit on her. I think it's just a glitch in the game, but it's kind of really fucking funny. But even though she has a man, he still tries to ask her out on a date. Honestly, pretty fucking. It's honestly pretty fucking funny. I don't think it's happened to me before because I really don't focus too much on marrying her. I marry basically everyone else except her. I'm a huge, I'm a huge Shane simp. So what the fuck am I supposed to do this, Moss? Tomorrow, tomorrow Pierre should be selling my shit. So then y'all can see how awful that man is. And how he's always, he steals, he steals from me if I sell my shit directly to him. Or it doesn't even have to be to him, it could be to anyone. I could be selling stuff to fucking Marnie. Or selling like a bunch of fish to, um, what's his face? Willie. What's the... You're appreciate you appreciate because it, at least you don't creep us out by coming in the door in the morning. <laughs> yeah, sorry, he, like Lucy, you're not even the scary. You're not even the, he's not even the scariest thing in this bitch anymore. It's Elliot. It's most definitely Elliot. I mean, Shane is scary too because he's watching me, and I'm pretty sure Haley goes on my farm when <laughs> she goes on my farm when I'm not there or when I'm sleeping late at night. Can I put stuff in here? Not that. No, 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 close enough. Looks good enough. I need to give your okay. So today, I have two important bor two important bor no, two important birthdays. Jorts and Sterling. I need to go and give both of them things. They are very. Both of them are very important to me. One is a cat, and one is my boyfriend. <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> Dear Puddles, Dear Puddles, I dreamt about you again last night. Although I don't recall the exact details of the dream, I woke up and... <laughs> inexpressibly frustrated and lost, hands still on my heart. I realize now that I cannot go on like this. I love you, Puddles. There is no person I love more than you. This is why I can't continue to hide behind any... In, in, in the, I cannot even try saying that. Shamelessly spilling my hopeful and honeyed words of affection your way. I want you to see me. I want your heart to be... to be <laughs> accompanied... Occupied by me and me alone. He put the put the oh my god of the fucking flowers. As such, I must say goodbye to you here, my dear, in order to be with you for eternity. But also, but I assure you that I will always be watching over you, your faithful admirer. What does that mean? What does that mean? What does that mean? Wait, what does that mean? Wait, what is he? Yeah, thanks, George. Thanks for the fried eel. What does that mean? Good day, Sims and Jay. Hi, Golden. I what? The, I'm scared. Puddles, I have great news. My my novel is finished. I'm giving a public reading on the afternoon to the library. Hope you see. Hope to see you there. Elliot, I want. I gotta see if you're alive at this point. That was a very concerning letter. Like, look, I don't like you and shit, but I'm very concerned about your health. 
Let me pet my chickens first and collect collect their eggs. I don't even know if this if the if, if the mod where my chickens get sick is working. <laughs> I'm too scared to try though. Oh yeah, I still need to go into. Damn it! Now the cows are growing up. I don't have anything to milk them with. We're gonna make. Okay, Marcy, Sugar Spice, Betty, Marceline. We're gonna make. You're gonna be the one getting people pregnant. I, yeah, you're gonna be the one. I wonder if you. I wonder if you'll be able to do it naturally. I don't know, but yeah. What's I doing? Oh yeah, gathering my crops. Sounds like Kimetsugu. Hold on, I got a song. <laughs> Hold on, I got a song that could summarize what Elliot mean. He's gonna. He's. I'm scared. I don't know if he's gonna. If he's gonna harm me or himself. I know he said, "Oh, I would never harm you." That's what they always say before they harm you. <laughs> um. Do I need this? No. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna keep these flowers though. These flowers are. We're keeping these flowers. And, um. We're gonna sell everything to Pierre. Did you pet your cows? Yeah, I just got done petting them. <laughs> it's literally like, I'm gonna kill myself. Bye. I'll eat the puzzles. I love you means you're never, ever, ever getting rid of me. He's gonna kill me. I just wanna live. I just want to live my life. Oh, hi, Kenneth. Kenneth. Here, I, have, I, got, I got you this. I saw a kiwi rolling through the, the trees the other day. I'm sure I just misunderstood what I was seeing. Uh, yeah, we'll go with that. We'll go with that. Yesterday, I was thre the kiwi threatened to stab me, but I'm pretty sure I was just hallucinating or something. <laughs> hey darling, parading your pretty face around town today. Oh my god. Stop. Sterling leans in to steal a fleeting kiss from you. Oh my god, stop. You're at work. Just make just make sure you don't push yourself too hard. Call me if you need any help if you need any if you need any help with your work. Sterling, I don't know if it's a good idea to have you around my farm. <laughs> Hi guys. Lewis tells, tells me your tomatoes are ripened. That's great news. Just imagine what Clary would do without tomatoes. I need you to go. I, look, I need you. I need you to go into your thing. This man is so lucky he's still alive. <laughs> Sterling, you adorable fuck. <laughs> he's just so fucking cute. I just want to smush his face. And today is his birthday. I need to wait until Gus goes into his shop, which I think he he opens his store at twelve. And the and Jorts likes fish, so I can just catch some fish for him. And I will still be catching fish for his sister because equal equal rights. You think he knows everyone wants to kill him? He probably knows that, but he's also depressed, so I don't think he cares. <laughs> I think he genuinely just doesn't care. He's just like, man, if they kill, if I die, I die. But I still have to go to work tomorrow. I don't know if they like pikes. I mean, rain, they probably like the rainbow fish. God damn it. But I know they like sunfish. Oh god, it's Haley. Did you see last night's episode? Did you see last night's episode of Tears? Sob. I can't believe Kyle and Amy broke up. It 
Is that foreshadowing? Are you trying to break me up with my man? I would honestly believe that. Yandere haven't killed Sterling because they know because they, they they know you love him. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that does make sense. So like we don't want to kill him because it would hurt you. But if <laughs> Oh god. I'd be so horrified if he just stood behind me, not saying a goddamn word. Whenever I sit down to write, I can't help but think of you. You're my source of inspiration. What do you be writing, smut? <laughs> <laughs> of course you mean so much more to me than that. Than just that. You're probably writing smut. He's probably in his fucking... <laughs> his fucking fan fictions. Puddles... Puddles x Elliot. I'm pretty sure the cats are gonna be in here. Wait, let me make sure. They're probably not. What the fuck? Okay, no, Jorts... Jorts is... Jorts, why are you working on your... No, I already know this is. I already know this. I already seen this before. Jorts, God damn it, Jorts! Why are you working on your day off? I mean, I can get why Sterling is doing it because he's a human, but you're a cat. Oh wait, no, you're outside the building. Hi, baby. Hi, Pose. Did you know it's my birthday today? I picked it because it's workers' holiday in some countries. Oh, that's so cute. Morris had the nerve to try to throw water on me, talking about the unions is federally protected activity, you know. Here are my sweet babies here. You can have this. And you can have this as well. Oh, this is lovely. Thank you for sharing with me. My sweet babies. Now I need to go to Gus and buy... I'm pretty sure... What is that man like? I could give him beer, but I'm probably gonna just... I should just give him a field snack. No, I'm gonna buy him spaghetti. I feel like spaghetti is better than a field snack, no matter what he- I know he likes field snacks more, but you're getting fucking spaghetti. Oh my god, Elliot's still alive. He's probably writing smut. <laughs> Pot meat kettle. I don't write smut. I'm not you. <laughs> I'm not good at writing smut. <laughs> I had a feeling you would bring me something wonderful. This is fantastic. Hi, Caroline. On Wednesdays, the shop is closed. Yeah, I know your husband's awful. Keep that in mind if you're going to need anything. I need you. My, I know my boyfriend's right there, but he knows what I am. <laughs> oh, oh, what? Oh, oh, I thought, I thought the mop wasn't working. I hate to be blunt. But if those other girls don't back off, their lives are going to end rather short. They're going to <laughs> end rather short. Oh, Jesus Christ. Leah, I just came to say hi. <laughs> Damn. Okay. Um, hi. Hi, too. I, hi. Hi. Um... Sterling, sorry I'm late, boss. Pierre, you literally got murdered, Sterling. I still got work to do. <laughs> I don't write smut. Don't make me pull those blowjob head cannons. That's not smut. That's <laughs> those are facts. <laughs> or the post about Fujin. I have receipts. The fact that you have the fact that you that you that you have that just shows how much smut you inhale. I have not read any smut in so many, unless you count me talking to character AI and trying to harass them. Because... <laughs> oh, I was harassing. I love, I like harassing people in character AI. It's funny. <laughs> My next target is Alfred. I got some summer seeds available. Give me something else. Give me something juicy. Tell me about your failing marriage. Which you probably don't know is failing. Oh shit, it's Beatrice. Wait, no, let me talk to Beatrice. I have not spoken to her. Hi, Beatrice. Hello, can I help you with something? Are you settling down the old farmhouse? I wonder what you like. I can, I'll bring you things. I don't actually have it to say. I just remember you wrote those two. Uh-huh. <laughs> I remember when I mentioned it. I was like, oh yeah, oh god, he's right there. He's on my fucking farm. I guess I should... Go check out the thing. Let me sell this stuff first. Did 
Damn, my thing is getting full. I'll organize some of that stuff later. Okay, I don't need that. Uh, what else? I think those are the... Nope, this as well. Um, I'm pretty sure Clint's going to be closed by the time I get there, so I'm not going to worry about it. Oh my god. Wait, aren't you supposed to be at the library? You said you are doing a reading. I'm probably not going to... I don't really... Unless it's actually going to be something concerning, I'm probably not going to watch the cutscene. Because I know the OG Elliot, he just sits there and talks about something else, something completely irrelevant. Yandere Elliot might actually be like, I'm going to fucking blow this down to smithereens. Rose are red, violets are blue. I would kill everyone in this fucking town for you. Because no one else writes the same goofy and horny like you do. I swear someone else did, but maybe they do. <laughs> maybe I. Maybe it's because I don't take myself seriously and I think my writing is sucks. So, yeah. <laughs> Puddles, you made it. I feel so relieved to be done with my book. It's like an elephant's been lifted off my shoulders. Okay. It's gonna be like a normal reading, though, right? Well, I better get started with the reading. Wish me luck. Elliot. I'm so scared. Please let it be something like... Good afternoon, everyone. Oh my god, what if he just... What if he locks the fucking doors? What if he locks the fucking doors and he just... <laughs> let me not say what I'm thinking. <laughs> no. Oh my god, being in America too long has kind of fucked my mind. Ever since I was a young boy, I dreamed about, I dreamed about becoming a writer. When the time came for me to leave home and start my life, I moved here. I was drawn to the peaceful beauty of the valley and hoped in the days of quiet reflection in this... It, what the fuck is that even word? What the fuck? Why do y'all keep using big words? No, not even just big words. Words I've never fucking seen in my life. Atmosphere well, would fan the literary flames. After countless hours of scribbling, writing, scribbling at my writing desk, I... I present to you my first novel, Cam Cam Camellia Station. It's a romance novel about a train, wait, about a train stewardess who falls in love with a traveling or archon, ain't you? What, the, what? I'm so scared. Chapter one, your ticket, sir. Oh my God. No, we're not, we're not reading all this. I honestly thought he was gonna, I th honestly thought he was gonna fucking say something completely unhinged. Clara, there's something I must tell you. She, he blurted. He blurted as she turned to leave. Clara turned slowly and saw the look of desperation in so fucking eyes. At that moment, Gosman bursted into into carpetant red faced. Well, that well, that concludes my reading. I'll be selling signed copies of the book by the front desk. Thanks for listening. What if he just read? Like, he just read a bunch of spy. That'd be fucking wild. I feel like writing not safe headcans for MK characters. It's cute. Not safe headcans are really popular in the MK community, so I mean, if you want to, Jay, but people will leave the most unhinged comments. <laughs> they will. The sad thing is, I'm probably the only one here who, who's never written not safe for work. I kind of, I kind of believe that, but I do believe that you pro you probably considered it. Well, I've only lived once, and I feel like writing not safe is one that has to be one of my personal favorites. Yeah, because it's... <laughs> I personally just like fucking around. But I have written not safe for work. I've written smut of Gary and Kage, but I'm probably not going to post it nowhere. Anyway, <laughs> well, well, how was it? It was great. Thanks. You know, I got the idea for writing a romance novel from you. Do you remember? Yeah. That's why I dedicated this book to you. Oh my god, not the blush. Calm down. Get away from me. I just came here because I want to make sure you were okay. You didn't get off yourself. God damn it. I just wanted to donate my bullshit. And then this. And this. And this. Yay! He does seem like to type the right smut. Yeah, I think he just didn't- I, just, I think he just didn't read it this time. 
I think the and the reason I got back into Call of Mortal Kombat was smut head cannons that were they were serious, but they were also low key funny. And I was like, I want to be low key funny, but I want to go a little bit harder into. It. <laughs> Some of these are made for relaxation photos. How about we escape? Wait, how about we escape the heat and spend a lazy afternoon together? It's not you too, bitch. Not you too, bitch. Not you too. No, fucking Sadaru. No, goddammit. I'm not one of your fucking fingers. I have a man. I have a man. <laughs> Everyone get off my fucking dick. Alex, I have not spoken to you in a minute. How are you doing today? What's up? Wanna hang out? You're literally working alone. No, you're literally working and Haley's right there. She's gonna kill. You know what? I'm gonna let the two yandere's hang out together. I don't write it, but I can imagine. I can imagine it. Smut is fun to write, but also stressful because you want to make sure stuff sounds correctly. Well, sounds correct. Fuck. See, I can't even make it sounds correct. My issue is I literally cannot pull myself to write smut. Like I physically cannot do it. I have been trying to get over it, but something keeps holding me back. Tumblr hates me and keeps putting. <laughs> Liu Kang Master back in my dash. <laughs> and honestly, the Liu Kang fans concern me. <laughs> Are you sure it's not you? Because you usually you have to like stuff and so it can be put in your feed. Unless you're liking, you're probably liking other head, not safe for cat cans. But hey, I don't know. What do I know? It's almost time to feed Pinkie Pie again. Shit. I also have a snake that I need to feed. You see, snakes can actually extend, expand their mouths and swallow their prey whole. Would you swallow me whole? It means it takes a long time for them to digest anything they eat. So there's usually a big gap between their meals. Can you imagine having lunch now and then only having it again two months or so? Fascinating. That is fascinating. I love hearing you talk. You can literally bench press me if you want. People I follow are reblogging it. Oh. Yeah, that makes sense. Summer is boring for bird watching. Farron Islands are covered in fruit and stuff. So songbirds go go on vacation just like people do. I'm gonna, I'm gonna flirt with your dad. Where's Penny? Where is Penny? I'm low key scared. Oh, okay, the kids the kids aren't in school. So okay, Penny's up there with Maru. I think Maru and Penny would be a cute couple. They're both they both like books and stuff, so that that, that I can I can get behind that. Horny bastards, I say if <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what if that wasn't Penny? What if that was fucking Robin? I'm pretty sure that was Penny. I'm pretty sure I saw her name. Oh, wait, no, she's right there. God damn. Okay. Oh, man, I went right past you motherfuckers, and y'all didn't say anything. What sort of gadget should I tinker with this summer? Puddles, you know how sometimes we experience particular dreams? Well, I had this uh, silly dream where I um, happened to see you peacefully sleeping. It was, oh god, nothing significant really, just fleeting vision that caught me off guard. Dreams can be so whimsical, don't you think? Anyway, let's not dwell on such truth. You saw me sleeping? What matters is... We're awake now, and everything, and every waking moment is an opportunity for us to create beautiful memories together. In this realm of reality, of course. Okay, here's, there you go. I could see them dating. Hi, Penny. You're such a simp. At least I can control myself. <laughs> I can I can control myself when 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 Sterling is around. Not so much when Nora's around, but Nora is a different case. That woman is adorable. Oh my god. I don't know any of these bitches in this town. I see. 
I have to wait until Pierre leaves so I can steal from him some more. Damn, it's a big ass fish. You put Raiden on a pole. You put Bihan on a pole. <laughs> and you told me when I was trying to figure out if I should draw Hanzo or, or Miguel you told me to draw Hanzo when I was drawing him with his wee wee out when well, I was wee wee out but his wee wee being covered by a blanket let's not start pointing fingers <laughs> because we're both down bad I put pole I put behind on the pole for the meme sure that's what they all say <laughs> So it's also, it's a coincidence that you like Bihan as well. Maru, Penny, calm down, you horny bastard. <laughs> she said she saw me when she, oh my fucking God, she's gonna do things to my body while I'm sleeping. But yeah, it's totally a coincidence that you just, you put him on the pole and you just so happen to also like him. What a what a coinkadink. Have I spoken to you today? No, I've not. Oh my god, stop talking about my ass. <laughs> oh. Well it's true pose, you're so fucking hot. Oh yeah, he's maxed out. I think he's just gonna be saying that. Oh god, Elliot's also maxed out. Oh god, and Alex is almost there and Haley and uh, oh, look at Jorts. Jorts is almost maxed out too. Yay. I just need to fill them up with fish. I don't like Beyond that much, honestly. I like him with Serena, but he ain't my type. I have a lot of types in the fictional world, and y'all are going to see that on Friday. <laughs> I forgot how many... How, there, how many hot characters there are in... And Black Butler. I forgot that one angel that was whipping that was whipping Sebastian. I forgot about her. <laughs> oh yeah, I was supposed to be organizing this. Um, I guess I, since I'm I'm gonna be eating this, I guess I could take this inside or put this in the thing. I was trying to wait for that old fuck to tell me, hey. Oh wait, God damn it! I forgot to grow these. Is it, can I grow these now? I think I can. I'm going to. I completely forgot that these were in there. Gosh darn it. And anything else? Oh yeah, that can go inside. See, I could have. I could have made blueberry tart. Um, I could bring this inside. Get to stay outside. I can bring this inside. I can bring that inside. Uh, I'll leave these out here for now. Oh, I can bring that inside. Why do I? Oh, I can bring that inside too. I can throw this away. I don't really need this no more. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna put. Throw you over here. Let me sell this shit. What the fuck? There he goes again! There he goes again! He's on my fucking farm again! Y'all see that shit? I'm not crazy! He's on my farm again! What the fuck? God damn it! The <laughs> I like behind, but I like I make him into a bottom stuff. He is a bottom. I think that man's too stressed out to be a bottom, but that's just me. <laughs> Elliot, for fuck's sake! <laughs> He's gonna kill us, I feel. I feel like that's what's gonna happen. I stand behind being a service top. 
if you know if you know what that means. I also believe Harvey is a service top. You're trying bombs. You're saying bombs can't be stressed. Oh no, it's just I'm literally a stressed bottom. But fucking. I don't know. I like seeing him be a top because literally everyone does that thing where, oh, here's a big man that I'm going to make into a bottom. It's, it, it, was, it was cute at one point and it was funny at one point. Now I'm just tired of seeing it. <laughs> I get tired of seeing the same trope over and over and over again. Especially when people make it like it's the only thing. Not saying that y'all do that, but I see, I see that a lot. Like they make Kwai Lang a bottom all the time. When by when Kwai Lang was still Sub Zero, he was they made into a bottom. So when what's it called? I like seeing the ver the role like people being like, oh no, we're gonna make Kwai Lang and Bihan be tops. I'm like, yay, give it to me. Give it, give 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 it. I want it. I want this new thing. God damn it. Liu Kang is, is Kwai Lang is, um, Kwai Lang is a bottom, is, is stupid, not a bottom. I love my baby Kwai Lang. He's my, he's still my baby girl but more of the traumatized one because he's just so sassy. I love it. God damn, it's Tuesday, so I can't go to M M Marnie. I wonder if I can just go and steal a bucket from her. I would I would I would be open to stealing a fucking bucket from her. Cuz I need milk. I need milk so then I can fuck. So then I can make cheese. I was gonna go to Pierre, but I need to go on and start filling up my thing. I'll keep that for now. I need to, I wanna get back to playing Oh, I did not mean to do that. Um, I need to get back to playing Sunhaven. Sunhaven is like Stardew Valley, but um, it's like Star. Oh god, damn it! That's what I need. I needed like five of those or something. It's like Stardew Valley, but I guess more whimsical. Part of the reason why I'm, ha I'm having some trouble with not safe work handcans is some MK characters I feel aren't as sexually active. Honestly, same. I mean, I personally don't see, I don't see Bihan and Kwai Lang being sexually active. And I'm gonna die on that hill, honestly. I don't even really see, and I don't see Kung Lao as being sexually active either. There's like a lot of characters I don't really see as being sexually active. Like very sexually active. Like despite thirsting after Lord Raiden, I know that man does not give one two fucks about having sex. <laughs> but I can dream. Oh God. I need to fish more. Yeah, I need to fish for these bastards more. I literally see the polar, the opposite. I yeah, I see. I mean, I see. I have not I see a lot of a lot of bottom behind. I mean, at first there was a lot of top behind before. Everything changed when the fucking f the Fire Nation attacked. Because at first it was a lot of, you know, 
I could get, you know, wanting to see all the little different, but now it's just so common. I'm just like, no, I'm tired of it. God damn it. Okay, so I can't. I need to get just plain wheat. Okay. And apples. Okay. Okay, and I need God damn the fuck am I, I need a duck feather, I need sunflower, I need a sea urchin, I got a sea urchin. Um I don't have that yet. God, I need to cook more too. Um Why why do you think Luke Ku King Kwai Lang is a virgin joke win as long as it did? I don't even think he's a virgin. Now, don't get me wrong, I do not think that man is a virgin, because I'm pretty sure he was an adult when Bihan was murdered. Or at least, like, in his teens. Like, I'm pretty sure he's had sex at least once, but I'm pretty sure now that he's a grandmaster, I feel like that man... He, he fucks. Well, he's, he fucked at one point, but once he became grandmaster and all that shit happened with his brother, I'm pretty sure he was like, no, nah, I don't want to fuck anymore. <laughs> That's my head canon that he just kind of just doesn't give a fuck. But I love the idea. Raiden isn't sexually active yet. He has a slutty outfit. Yeah, because he just because he, he doesn't. I feel like he just doesn't fucking understand what he does to women and men. Just like everyone just everyone's like Raiden. <laughs> Raiden. Do you like? Do you do you not understand what you're doing? Like no. What what do you mean? This is just my clothes. I don't know why you mortals are getting so getting your panties in a twist over fucking clothes. To be fair, Bottom Behind was a long thing before MK1 came out. They mostly stayed isolated in the Virina fan base. That's probably why I didn't see it then. Cause you know I you already know I don't care for that ship at all. Johnny, why do you dress like a <laughs> what? <laughs> But fucking, it's not even just, it's not even Raiden, it's literally Fujin. Fujin dresses the most like a slut. Raiden keep is mostly covered the most of the uh, majority of the time, except for that one time he had the booby window, and I literally lost my shit. And they were like, okay, here's here's the booby window, here's a, here's the booby win window, it's a little cheap. And, and that one when we had that one, when he had his, I think an MK3, when he had his chest exposed. I could just slaughter some of them and get their meat and then put it in here. I will be considering that. God, that's why I shouldn't have so many goddamn... Let's just start taking it here. Right, this is my traditional outfit, so why do you have your tits out? <laughs> it's just it's literally only the fucking Americans that see it that way I swear to god it's only us because I'm pretty fucking even though my boyfriend is also American he'd put he he's like oh no that's just regular um Japanese clothing and I was like oh yeah that would make sense like so it would definitely be like Sonya Sonia and Johnny, they're like, what the fuck are y'all wearing? Because Kung Lao and Liu Kang also dress with their, their chest exposed. And their fighting style. But, yeah, they would, I'm pretty, yeah, they'd still question it. Just, just a little bit. Oh, I need another fucking red mushroom. I need to get some droppers for that. I need to get some wood. I need to get that all coming there in the fall. Unless I find it in the in the mine shaft. God damn it, I don't have a my melons haven't my melons have not fucking gotten haven't finished growing yet. It's bullshit. Um, what else? Jelly, I can make some jelly.
The floor of Snake pointed out that the amount of MK characters we have evidence would have constantly fucked us apart on the shore, and that is funny to me. I mean, it makes sense, since the game is mostly fighting. I would imagine, and then they were in a war at one point, I would imagine that no one's going to be too keen on having sex. My favorite headcanon that I saw was that one person was like, I'm pretty sure Ma I'm pretty sure Raiden masturbates. And I was just like, yeah, I'm pretty sure they take care of it the old fashioned way. <laughs> if the need comes along, cause you know, you know, sex is good and all that, but you know, when you got shit to do and you don't really want to sit there and deal with emotional shit with people, it's better to just beat, beat, beat it and leave. <laughs> beat it and keep on fighting. That person, I, they don't they don't make your head cans anymore, but I still follow them in case one day they decide to come back and just drop a wild ass head cannon. God, this is gonna be so this is why I just like this is exactly why I bought that thing. God damn it, I need a fried okay, I do have a fried egg. And truffle. Alright. But yeah. Okay. Bitch. Okay, so this thing, these two things are glowing. These th things aren't. I know why that's doing it. God damn it. Where? Oh, right there. Fucking blind ass. There we go. Good thing Liu Kang is celebrating what is celebrated as one. I, I could. Wait, God Liu Kang being celebrated is one I could seriously believe. Oh yeah, absolutely. I feel like he he's too hung up on his katana that I don't think he'd really be interested in having sex at all. Jax, okay, Raiden, I know it's your traditional outfit, but you know you can't your tit out. He's like, bitch, I've died a million times. I wish someone would stab me in my titty. <laughs> Like all jokes and memes aside, I'd believe Liu Kang is not getting any. I mean, now he's not. He was absolutely getting. He was absolutely getting some when he before he became a god because katana. He was absolutely fucking katana. Maybe not a whole lot, but they absolutely had sex. I I hundred percent believe that Kung Lao does not get any. Nothing beats a refreshing swim on a hot summer day puddles. Oh my god. Robin's a kind boss. She's your boss? She let me take a break pretty regularly. Even still, most of my breaks are spent doing more work doing work for Pierre. Don't work for that bitch. I'm gonna go steal from him. Wait, do you like Everyone likes sweet peas. Do you like sweet peas? Will you take this? This is useful. Thanks a lot. Aw. He's so adorable. I love him. There's actually a mod that makes the farm the female the female farmers with the boobies mix their chest bounce. And I was just thinking about what if my boobs bounced? I would never do that on here for God's sake. Or or on really in, in the fucking my personal gaming too, because mods like that take up space. But it would still be funny. Cause um usually the, the nips are out. So, um, yeah. Damn. Let me see how much this sells for. Let me water gin. I should also go on and see if I can build a preserves jar. And I should also check my goddamn... Check my goddamn... My cave. I have not checked my cave in a minute. 
Oh shit. Um, I need some of these. I need another one of these. I need a fucking shed. Yeah, I was gonna say, oh shit, I should go to Marnie's, but I remembered that today's Tuesday. She's not gonna be in her fucking... I get she's working out, and working out is important, but bitch, you run a store. This is exactly why you have to screw Mary Lewis to keep your shit open. Um, I should keep all my machines in one area, or at least a similar area. Uh... I mean, I guess I could keep y'all down here. Let me go ahead and clear these out. I need to go in and get hardwood too, so. Because I'm tired of fucking walking. I need to. I want my horse. And getting iron is not going to be as hard as getting 100 wood. I'm a little surprised Liu Kang and MK1. Liu Kang and MK1 Katan didn't get together. Are you? I mean, he literally made her. I don't think he. I don't. I don't think he'd. I honestly don't think he would do something like that, especially since it's not. He knows it's for sure. It's not his katana. It's like. I don't think if I was able to make my boyfriend, I, I don't think, thinking about, if I, if, I, if I could make my boyfriend, I don't think I would like him as much as my organic boyfriend. Like, sure, I could, you know, give him a happy life and shit, but it's not going to be like the same person that I, you know, grew up with. Because it's... I don't know. Like I, 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 I can see. I can. I already kind of knew he wasn't gonna get with her. That whole "I love you" in, in every universe thing. I have more gore-related headcans with Raiden than I do horny ones. Jesus Christ. Listen, I don't... I didn't know what to expect out of that game. <laughs> Fuck. I can't wait until I go into the fucking desert and then I get to get... God damn it, God went to the fucking water. I was not even looking at my my health. But thankfully, it's fine. To be honest, I was kind of interested in MK1 Katana and Johnny more than MK1 and Raiden. Honestly, same. I thought it would be funny and it would be cute. But I already knew they weren't gonna, they're probably not gonna go that route. Okay, now I'm about to pass out. But hey, 33. I need, I don't know how much I need left. Oh, that, that fish in my pond. I want that fish. That really fat orange fish. I think I don't think it's a goldfish. I think it's something else. Kind of the same hung up of writing something between Luna and Luke Kang because he made her. And I'm not going to lie, I feel a little fucked up about that. 
I mean, it could still work. I just feel like current Liu Kang, he's so in love with um, the other. Um, he's so if he felt if he fell in love with her with another universe, it might be different. Like if he fell in love with her with the in the universe before this one, then maybe you know you know it'd be a little bit different. But I mean, you could still do it. I'm not gonna stop you. I'm not gonna fucking <laughs> arrest you. Could it work though? It feels kind of gross. You're well. You're talking to someone that's like into talk, well, like not, not completely healthy relationships. I mean, well, what's what do you what do you think is gross about it? I know I know they wouldn't, but at least they had interesting chemistry. I wouldn't mind their friendship. Yeah, that too. They, yeah, they have a cute friendship. <laughs> Him being like, hey, watch this. I'm finna go hit on that lady. And then she's like, no, nah, don't do it. She's gonna stab you. And then he, he nearly gets killed and Katana has to go over there and save his ass. Like, I told you, you stupid bitch. I'm not gonna stop you. You gave me the idea. How is that my fault? <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm not gonna force you to do it. Shit. I've read some really wild and fucked up relationships and I don't really think of a god that basically may. I mean, Puddles. Puddles fucking. There's like so many gods and mortals fucking. Like, I'm pretty sure there's a. I'm pretty sure someone has written smut of the Christian god fucking immortal. I'm pretty. I'm so sure of it. I'm so sure of it. I'm, I'm so sure that there is Christian god smut out there. Someone is like, oh, I'm so I'm so Christian in love with God, and I want him to rearrange my guts. And if there's not, then I will make it. <laughs> I will be the first. I will fucking make that tag. They're thinking, oh, it's like a you know a OC God or a God from like a like a show. Nope. I'm talking about Sky Daddy. <laughs> I'm gonna throw this in there. And this. I read some Luke XP on fanfic, so you'll be fine. I'm probably the worst person to ask for like advice with that shit, because I, I enjoy questionable relationships. Like literally Literally, fucking Kage and Yuri. You ship Kage and Yuri, and their relationship is is abusive. <laughs> so I wouldn't be worried about Liu Kang and and um, Luna. I kind of want to give that flower to someone. I thought I needed it, but I don't. So I'm probably just gonna go give it to some random bitch. I found Liu Kang X Tanya the other day and I had to pause. That's actually fucking. I've seen the most wild ships that I actually. I'm like, huh, I never thought about that. Never thought about Liu Kang and Tanya. Liu Kang has been a guilty pleasure ship as of late. Liu, Liu Hang? Oh, yeah, Liu Hang, yeah. No, for me, that's a full on pleasure. I love that ship. I think it's funny as hell because. <laughs> <laughs> I just I just love the thought of them hate fucking I wouldn't ship it if you didn't if you didn't draw him grabbing her neck wait when did I do that oh god there's so much milk in here <laughs> who's been milking you bitches <laughs> I haven't been milking you Elliot has Elliot been milking you bitches <laughs> I, I'm not milking you. Who's milking you? There's milk all over the floor. There's milk everywhere. 
everywhere. What the fuck? Elliot, I'm about to talk to Elliot. <laughs> Elliot, are you milking my fucking cows? <laughs> Reptile is Cassie is probably the weirdest one I found. I can't think of the weirdest one I found. Throw this over here, and then I'll put you over here. Elliot's, oh, Elliot is over here grabbing on the wrong tits because he's over here milking my fucking cows. What do I do with these fucking moss? I don't know what to do with the moss. Is there a recipe for this shit? Maybe I should just collect it and just wait. I need to cut down more trees so I can upgrade my thing anyway. Look at all these baby trees that are trying to grow. Kano X Raiden was a weird one I found. Oh yeah! That was also a weird one that I saw. But I was like, you know what? I'm desperate for Raiden, 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 Raiden smut, so I'll take it. And I did. I did. <laughs> This gnome was thirsting after Raiden, and I was found that, and I was like, you know what? Close enough. <laughs> I need to go to Marnie's place. Please let that ho please let that hoe be at her house. Okay, she's at her house. Wait for my return at dawn at third year. Bitch, if I make it that far. Let me clear this out before I go. Oh god damn it! What did it? What did this strike? See now I need to make those fucking rods, bitch. Did you just kill it. Did that bitch just kill a tree? Or some girl paired Kenshi and Serena. And honestly, probably that's honest, that's probably one I'm fine with. And also, it's probably one I'm fine with that one. I've never seen that one, but I I could see it. I've seen a lot of people shipping Kenshi and Melina, and I thought that was cute. But a lot of people... You 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 already know what happened. <laughs> you already know what happened. I don't even have to fucking say it. Because as a bisexual person, apparently bisexuals can't be with anyone that's not... That's not, like, in a gay... A visually gay relationship. Apparently, maybe I can make that. No, I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep that wheat because I don't know when's the next time I'm gonna steal from that horror pier. And this one's gonna go outside. But the whole Kenshi and Melina ship. The reason I thought it was cute was because it's literally just her a pop being feeling bad for stabbing his eyes. And I was just like, I could see that. I could see that working. And I have not read any fan fiction. I just seen a little bit of intel on it. But I would like to see like a long-term fan fiction of her being like, I apologize for stabbing your eyes. And then them, you know, Reconciling or whatever. I definitely can get. I, I definitely can get Kenshi x Melina. Fuck, I, I get Melina x with Bihan. I've never seen Melina with Bihan. I want to see that. Oh my god. Shane, or have you been drinking? Shane, god damn it. No. I already seen this. I already know he's going to talk about rolling off the thing. I already had Sterling talk about jumping in front of the trains. That's not the Oh my god. Melina, sorry about your eyes, Kenshi. It's fine. <laughs> Shane, exactly. Like, he's fucking... I got too much shit going on. I do not need to see 
him threatening, not threatening him, like, I'm gonna roll off this bitch. Oh my god, I can buy a doghouse? I can buy a cat tree? I don't know if this is a mod or if it's in the original game. I think it might be in the OG game. No, I need money for other- I need to buy heaters. I don't- yeah, I need money to buy heaters. Because fall is right there and I don't want my animals getting sick. Oh! We're gonna- I need to show you that one thing that I was talking about. You rummage through Marnie's dresser. It's mostly long dresses, but there's a pair of- There's a pair of brown suspenders in here as well. You know who else wears brown suspenders? Lewis. That bitch be over here fucking- <laughs> And for some reason, keeping it a secret. Maybe I should. What time is it? Maybe I should go in and propose to. I should go and propose to Sterling so then I can have that bitch on my farm. Because. Uh, it's gonna. I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to fucking divorce him. I feel like he's that. But I also want to see what it would be like to marry the other, the yandere's and everyone else. I can always make him forget, but then I'm going to remember. I'm going to remember, and then I'm just going to be sad. And I'm like seeing him walking around and shit. And then my ex-wife, my wife's I'm like, are you still in love with Sterling? And I'm like, no. <laughs> Whatever gave you that idea of wiping tears off my face. <laughs> like, I, I'm not in love with him at all. That's, that's crazy. That's my ex-husband. <laughs> Bro, I've seen Katana be paired up with both Beyond and Kwai Lang. You actually are paired up with fucking, what's it called, Bihan. What pissed me off, what pissed me off, did I, I choose to ignore, I choose to ignore this, is that they, they made Katana and Bihan cousins for whatever fucking reason. For whatever fucking reason, like, because they, because I, I, I guess, I'm guessing it's because they, they want Katana to end up with Raiden so badly. Which is because it would it would make sense if Katana was it would be interested in two very strong men like Bihan, strong and high ranking men like Bihan or Kwai Lang. But no, they're like, oh yeah, you know, they're like, we're gonna slap this one very this one small thing in the intro that no one's gonna I didn't even know about it until someone mentioned it and I think everyone collectively said no or a lot of the ones that I've seen that ship it they're collectively said no which I can understand because it was just completely and utterly useless They can fight me. Yeah, I think I'm gonna- I was gonna marry him. Sebastian, I want to marry- I think I want to marry Sebastian on Halloween. Let me put this in here with my cows. And then I'll put, oh wait, no, what the, where the fuck am I going? Yeah, even if I didn't ship it, I would say no. Yeah, because there's literally no reason. <laughs> they, you can, it's so, they could be a little bit, they could at least be a little bit less subtle about how badly they want to like make certain ships happen. Like they literally, they made Hanzo a kid for no fucking reason. No fucking reason. I'm still not over that. Ah, oh, fuck. Let me eat something.
It can fight me. But it is what it is. Sometimes the fandom, sometimes as a fandom, we all have to say no. <laughs> we all have to say no. That's not, we're not doing that. This may be your game. <laughs> but we're all saying no to that. I think even James thought it was stupid. Because it's a very throwaway line. I have not spoken to anyone in this town. Hey there, farmer. How's your crops doing? Would you like this flower? Thanks for the gift bottles. Take care of your land, and it will take care of you. How do you know that, you, you bastard? You're not even a bad guy. I'm just... You, your hair is just green. And I, and I really... And I don't even... I, I need to get... I need to start befriending more people in this fucking town. I have the passive thing, so when I talk to people... But I have, not, I have not fucked with literally anyone at the other town. Pierre. Oh, God damn it, Pierre. Let me rob you. Linus, what the hell? Linus, you're looking for a jade, but how would you get that money? Aren't you poor? Oh, yeah. There's a head cannon in Stardew Valley. That Linus used to have like a bunch of money, but he left it all behind to live out in the fucking woods. Those melons have been looking real good. Oh, what? What did he say? <laughs> what? Those melons have been looking real good over at Horny Farm. Lewis, what do you, Lewis, look. I'm sorry to let you down like this, but you're not my type of old man with graying hair. I'm more of a Linus girl. You're not, you're, no. <laughs> it's a no for me. I, I know that was one of your grandpa's favorite crops back in the day. Uh huh. Oh yeah, you're gonna try to do a quick save. Like, oh yeah, I know that was one of your, favorite, your, your grandpa's favorite crops. It'd take me a good day to explain to explore the mines. Who knows what you might find in those rare ores. Actually, it's a neutral day, so it's not a good day to explore the mines. But she wouldn't know that because you're not good at anything. Oh, I think I need one of these fish. The, the, the shed or whatever, shade, whatever. But yeah. I don't know if I'd ever post. I wanna. I've been. I've been trying to write like a little thing here and there, with my characters from a natural, so I can actually flush them out a bit. The main one that I just. I don't know. One night I just felt like writing Yuri X Kage. I don't even know where it came. I just thought about Kage going down on Yuri. That's all I thought about. I was like. You know what would be interesting if Kage went down on Yuri? Is that frog plotting my death? It probably is. You found the secret door. The the secret door in the game? I mean, I don't Do you, you mean the door in the... I mean, uh, I, I don't know. I've, I've I modded this game up the ass. I'm just enjoying the mods for the moment. I have not even... <laughs> I'm enjoying somewhat the base game, but mainly the mods. When I say enjoying, I mean I'm being scared. Because I have modded, I have, I added Yandere mods in here. But welcome, Lord Starlight. It's been a minute. I'm glad that you're still kicking. I need to go... That's what I was gonna do. I was. I need to. I'm, I'm not gonna go to the mines, and I'm going to wait. I might already have enough. I might already have enough. What's it called? Iron for the to get my horse, cause I want a horse. I want a horse, and I want to propose to my man. Some people have been shipping Reptile and Baraka and Smoke, and now I can't unsee them. <laughs> I've also been seeing that. 
Sorry you had to see me like that, Puddles. Oh god, what, what do you mean? What did you do? What did you do in the freaking thing? Hey, do you know what he did? Some fish come and go in season. Others only come out in, in the night or rain. Uh, okay, Willie. I'm cool with I'm cool with current reptile, but I still like big big lizard man reptile. Cause I just I miss I miss that reptile. I just I want him back. <laughs> Cause he him just just a lizard, a ninja lizard running around. I just, I want that. I want a lizard, a lizard wearing a fucking ninja suit running around. That's all I want. Maybe I'll make that myself, because I want that. A lizard running around as a fucking ninja. Causing mischief and getting his ass beat. A little me was like, damn, y'all need to stop fucking clowning on Reptile and Baraka. Leave my mans alone. <laughs> MK1 Raiden. Okay, but why Kano Raiden? It was one time. <laughs> that one time when they were allowed to make their own universe. <laughs> Kano's like, oh, I, I just did it because I fucking can I could. There was no love involved. I just did it because I could. That's the Kano X Raiden thing is the reason why. I did the whole thing. I, I posted, I wanted to make a comic of Raiden zapping puddles while he was, you know, they were having sex. Him just giving her a little zap. When I say a little, I mean a lot. Cause I saw there was one with Kano just going ham on Raiden. And then <laughs> Raiden's telling him to hold on a second. And then Raiden zaps him because Kano doesn't listen. But hey, he did try to warn him, but you know. Oh yeah, I want to make a fucking fish pond because I can get some good shit out of there. There's so much shit that I should be making. I can make a fucking... What? I can change the... That's so cute. Yay, I do have... I, I do have all those things. Yay. Robin, if you're not... Oh god. Oh, yeah, you're talking about how you almost tried to off yourself. I know, you're sorry. Yeah, I know. I we we've been through this before, Shane. Let me see what's my mail. What's going on in my mail? Dear Pose, I know you're busy on the farm. That's why you can't visit. I understand. You've been working so hard. Keep it up, and you can accomplish anything. Love, Dad. Bitch, Dad, just send me fucking rocks. That sounds about right. My chickies! Come here, my little babies. Oh yeah, I need to make sure y'all have food. But, um... If I ever do finish that, maybe I'll... Maybe I'll post... Since y'all are in my Discord, maybe I'll upload some of my stuff to the discord oh so they just they just automatically milk themselves what kind of bullshit okay that's very realistic i guess i don't even know what mod that is but hey i'll take it i need to make some have some things make cheese and i also need to make another one of these things so i can stop having to Keep this. I can make my wife blueberry tart because I I'm pretty sure I, I still I kept that wheat. And if I didn't I would be sad. I also want to marry Nora. Because 
Have you seen that woman? She is amazing. I think when the thing gets put on the console, when the updated version gets updated to the consoles, then I'll play it without mods because obviously I won't be able to. I mean, I could, but I won't because Nintendo would come in and they would kill my family. They would do it with a smile on their face. Oh, wait, let me drop my milk off. Drop my milk off and I'm gonna sell some shit to Pierre. Oh, wait, let me grab that for what's her face. I think I need this, and I need some iron. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, and then I guess I'll visit her first. Why well, I think I know that comic of Kano and Raiden fucking you're talking about? Fucking hilarious. Yeah, because <laughs> they killed me. I'm like, man, I want that to happen. <laughs> Poor man, zap the fuck out of him. <laughs> oh god damn it! Why are you not here? Why are you not here? I don't want to shoplift. You have nothing good to steal. Where are you, you slut? Robin, you're supposed to be at your store. You dirty whore. I did not mean for that to rhyme, but fuck. I'm gonna go propose to my man while I'm at it. I got a lot of things to do today. We're gonna be productive. A productive little harlot. Cause we gotta we gotta we gotta marry and divorce the town. But I'm not gonna I'm not gonna let them stay mad at me. I'm I'm gonna whatever money I have to spend to make them not be mad at me, I'll do it. Because Sterling, I cannot imagine him being upset with me. I, I, I'd be so disappointed in myself. But, um... <laughs> I wonder if I should make a comic of what I wrote last night. Because I, I, I came out of fucking nowhere. And it was honestly horrible. Wait, I shouldn't propose him at his fucking job. Man, having this much conviction about something, it feels good. It feels so, so good. What? I wish every day could feel like this. It, it sure would make getting sober so much easier. Oh my god, now I want to propose to him right now. Now I have to. Because now he's his day is already good and I want to make it better. Because that's how I am here. You're proposing? Puddles, I this is the happiest day of my life. I'm sorry, I'm trying not to cry. I do. I do think- Oh, I do. There's nothing I love more than spending the rest of my life with you. I need to go to Henry and Maya and call the whole town. There's so much to do, baby. <laughs> I hate that nickname, but if him calling me it, I'll pull up with it. This is the most exciting time of my life. The weight is killing me. Oh my god. Where the fuck? Where's fucking... Now I'm not even mad about fucking... Robin not being in her store, but I'm still a tiny bit pissed. I have to go. Hey, I finally beat the I finally beat the first level of Journey of the Perry King. Watching you play helped me a lot. We both lost. How'd you? Okay. Oh wait, yeah, I was supposed to be here to sell you some shit. Not gonna sell you that because that's for my wife. You don't get shit. There. Now I'm gonna leave. Oh yeah, he's so cute. But he's just so cute. Oh God, bitch! You're at the doctor's office. What did you do? Cut your hand off, you whore? Oh wait, no, not Nora. You don't need to be so nervous. It's gonna be okay. I promise you. As a scientist and a scholar myself, I am well aware that this is necessary and super simple procedure. But as a mere human being, a mortal, 
I'm allowed to freak out. Damn, that's so me. <laughs> oh, she's been to give her a shot, isn't it? I seriously need you to stay calm. We can't do it if you faint. It will only make things worse. Well, good. My plan is working. <laughs> hey, Nora. I love her. Ugh, I'm sorry, Mario. I'm not at my best now. It's okay. I understand. Just take deep breaths, okay? Puddles, excellent. Maybe you can help Nora calm down a bit. I'll help her calm down. <laughs> Well, actually, no, I'm about to get married. I'll hold, I'll hold your hand. We can, we can hold hands if you like. Unless you want to be in a poly relationship with me and Sterling. I will I will stop and download that mod so quickly. I'm sorry you have to see me. I'm sorry, I'm sorry you have to see me in such a state farmer. Truly, I get really nervous in situations like this. What am I nervous about? It's nothing serious, really. You see, um, everything started on the day uh, that I accidentally drank six shots of espresso. What the hell? Girl, what? Damn. I thought I could handle it. I usually do. What do you mean you usually do? But it was particularly hot. It was, a, it was a particularly hot day, and I ended up feeling very fatigued, which could happen to anyone, truly. Gunther ended up finding me passed out on one of the library tables. He helped me get home, but... He made me promise I'd see Harvey. And after I talked to Harvey, he said I needed to do a blood test on me to make sure everything else is okay. Oh, yeah, I knew it. Needles. The thing is, I, um, I'm afraid of needles, okay? There, I said it. No, honestly, I am too. Well, I was. Well, I still am. I just learned to deal with them, unfortunately. Yo, but why did I do it? I just wanted to study. I think I... I think... <laughs> I think I've girl bossed too close to the sun. I love her. I love her. She girl bossed too close to the sun. That's hilarious. Nora, I'm ready for you. Come in, please. Nora. Well, I am not ready for you. <laughs> I love her. I need to take her home with me. I need to talk to my husband about marrying her as well. We'll bring her into the family. I don't give a damn. No. <laughs> you see, I was just taking a power nap. Gunther is, Gunther is paranoid. I don't really need this. Nora, I understand you're afraid, but it's important to take care of your health. And this is necessary. I really think you might have an iron defensive defensive Fuck. My mom has that. And that's the reason you've been feeling fatigued lately, but I need to be sure. I promise I'll make it real quick. You won't even see it. Lying, bitch. That's what they told me. They took my blood before, too, and that's what they told me. And then when I got to the car, I almost passed out. Hey, why don't you list every species of lizard you can? Wait, why don't you, why don't you, fuck. Why don't you list every lizard of species you can think of until I'm done? Let's see how many you can name... And make a game out of it. They didn't do that shit for me. I I think I think I can do that. Great. Follow follow me then. Thanks for bearing with me, farmer. I'll see you around. You'll be fine. Unless they unless you're not. Robin, why the fuck are you not in your store? Are you satisfied with the new barn? I'm sure you'll raise some very happy livestock in there. Bitch, I want my horse. What's a healthy young person like you doing in here? Looking for dumb bitches like you that won't fucking build my stable. You're making me very unstable right now. Little shit. Poor Nora. It's always a bit hard for her. I'm glad you were around to help Puddles. Yeah, no problem. What'd you do to my wife? I'm trying to help Noah work on her fear of needles. It's not gonna work. It was very it was much, much worse when she when she first came to the valley. I thought I could have I thought I would have to sedate her at one point. Glad we were past that. Yeah, needles are awful. Until I started getting well, they're still pretty bad. I still hate fucking needles, but it got better. It got better when I started taking birth control. So, um, yeah. 
Summer night, summer, some summer nights, I'll walk down the beach to feel the sea breeze against me. When I close my eyes, it feels like it feels as though I'm, I could take flight and soar to places far, far away. If not for you, perhaps I'd really, perhaps I really do it. What? I'm only kidding. Don't take that part seriously. What? No. Nah, what? What? Elliot, I'm concerned. Elliot, please don't. Elliot, oh, where's Nora? I need, I need to give her this. Oh, she's oh she's down. Of course she's down by the thing. We're looking for Nora, but now we're looking at <laughs> your stupid ass, Robin. <laughs> yeah, we're looking for Nora, but I found your stupid ass. <laughs> oh, hi, Leah. I've never been much of a poet myself, but I understand Elliot more, more now that I've met you. Oh, god damn it! <laughs> They're both gonna team up on me and pin me down and read me poetry. I can't help but think about you and write out all my fantasies. I wish I could- What? You're what? Leah is writing smut. Leah is writing smut about me. Okay, um, I wish to live- I, I wish to live out with you. Fantasy, I wish to live out with you. She's writing smut. She has a Tumblr. She 100% has a Tumblr and she's writing smut. I'm scarred. Hey there, Puddles. Hi. Hope you are staying safe. I'm really not. I'm talking to Yonder. Is <laughs> Jazz, are you still scared of me? Is Shane going to be okay? No. <laughs> I don't know why he laughed when I said that. I was trying to be seen. I'll give. I'll give her this. Oh, look at that little cute box. Oh yeah, I was supposed to be trying to raise up the wizard. Instead of you're saying you're a wizard, Harry. Did I give her the pot? Oh my god, I gave her the blueberry tart. Oh my god. I gave her the blueberry tart. I didn't mean to do that. I'm gonna do something, and Yari, we're gonna- I'm doing it. I didn't mean to give her that blueberry tart. Fuck, wait, no, I didn't mean to do that either. That didn't happen. We're continuing with what's going on. That didn't happen. <laughs> Not, none of that happened. What the? What is this? Weekend. This weekend, summer twenty up to the twenty first, you can prove your freshwater skills and win prizes. No, any personal items found near this sign will be sent to Lost and Found. Oh, okay. Hi, Nora. All right, I know you're growing blueberries on your farm. It must be blueberry season. Would you bring me some, please? I want. Yeah, I I brought you. I, I just so happened I did bring you this. This is the best. Thank you so much. I'm so happy. I love you. Is that bitch still not upset <laughs> me for no fucking reason? That not fucking that fucking harlot, not at her fucking shop. Oh a deer! Look at the cute deer! That's so cute! I love pixel art. I love pixel art so much. I need to learn how to do pixel art. Pixel art is like my one of my favorite things to look at. I also need to clean out this fucking forest because goddamn. Laura, don't be mad at me. Leah and Ellie are the couple who want to simp for one person so much they <laughs> they want to stalk them. Yeah, they're a yon they're, they're definitely a yondery couple that are both after the same person. Like they get together being yonderies, but they're like, wait a minute. Oh my god, that'd be a cool, that'd be a fucking cool comic. A poly yandere, a two yandere's and one normal person that's just trying to live their life. The only yandere OC that I have, well, no, I, I kind of, oh no. Dexter is the only can one that I have, but I kind of want to make more. Because then I could draw more blood and stuff. Wait, let me go run back to my farm because I want to go grab some things so I can impress. Wait, no, actually, oh god, there he is. Hi, wizard daddy. It is, it is, it is now that the crops, wait, what is now that the crops that can make energy are born and it's up to people to live, it's up to people like yourself to harness it. There are two crops available and one is, and wait, and one has its seeds to utilize them as a pure, Wizard, what the hell are you talking about? Seek energy puddles. Enjoy the day. 
do you like do you do you like this? I need to figure out what you like here. Take this. Many things. This item has very interesting properties. Oh, so you do like that. You like that a lot, Jesus. I have a Yandere orc. I have a oh fuck not orc. A Yandere OC. But I want to remake her first and give her a name. We need more Yandere. What do we just all of us get our all of us get our Yandere OCs and make them fight. <laughs> Oh yeah, earlier I was thinking about making some Angstar of Puddles in Jen because I have issues and therefore she also has issues. Oh god, see you again. Hey there Puddles, anything exciting happening today? Leah wants to get into my pants. Me? Same as usual. Yeah, everyone wants to get into your pants. Leah wants to fuck me, but a bunch of fangirls and fanboys want to fuck you. I'm just collecting resources at this point. I have not been collecting shit. No, I don't think I'm not gonna fish here. I was gonna have I was gonna build get my thing built today, but I guess I can't because that harlot <laughs> that fucking Bitch, Robin, who's at the doctor's office? I got all my shit together and she wasn't even fucking there. I need to clean up my farm. My farm is so fucking messy. I need to start designing it and doing cool things with it, cause... <laughs> Open folds, close that fucking fish door! No, for real. Oh my god, I can't stand that shit. I would be so scared if someone saw a Kage and they're like, spreads folds. Nope, close them, bitches. <laughs> I don't even want to hear that shit. This is a, not in my Christian Minecraft server. Like, oh my god, is that is that Satoru Sprites Folds? No, sweetheart, don't do that. If I swear to God, if I have a kid, I really I don't I really don't want my kid to be online at all. Like, oh yeah, there's a cool you can make friends and stuff. Uh, we're gonna I'm gonna no, we're gonna I'll find another way. You'll you'll make friends another way, Billy. You'll make them in real life because Jesus tap dancing Christ. I'm gonna keep these two things together so I don't forget. Cause that slut is not at her store tomorrow, I swear to God. Can I go make it to Pierre and steal from him? I'm, I'll see if I can. Kage what now? Kage who's the fishing fish store, you whore? We were talking about how the, the the Gojo girlies are like, oh yeah, it's Gojo spreads folds. And <laughs> that's what we were talking about. I was saying that if Kage, if someone was saying that about Kage, I'd be I'd be so fucking scared. <laughs> Yay. We steal in this house. For legal reasons, we don't steal in real life. I mean, I don't, because, they, oh my god, I'm stealing back my corn, hell yeah. I'm gonna steal back my shit, and then I'm gonna sell it to him. You wanna know why? Because that's what boss bitches do. <laughs> He's gonna be like, what the fuck, did you just, <laughs> did you just buy this shit from me the other day? No, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> like, huh, like, I swear you just sold this to me, and now you're selling it to me. Like, this looks like the same thing that you just sold to me. Nope, I don't know what you're talking about, Pierre, you're crazy. Kagi, I only sleep with a few people and you ain't one of them. <laughs> I only sleep I only sleep with a very small handful of people and you bitches aren't aren't them. These might seem unreasonable, unfair puddles, but once you can name and 
But once you can name an unfairness, you can take the steps to address it. I don't always understand things, so I appreciate when people take the time to educate me. Same! I don't understand a lot of things. Even if I still don't completely get it, I feel a lot smarter. Yeah! I love jorts. I would actually murder everyone in this fucking town for this cat. You don't understand. I need- I wish I could adopt them and they could just live on my farm. Where's that mod? Where I, I can- like they can still come and go off my farm. They're just there. And I need- I need that. Hi Shane. My fiance's right there! What the fuck? If that slut is not at the store tomorrow, news to- <laughs> No! Oh yeah, the horny on main fangirls. Look, sometimes I'm horny on main, but these girls be damn, they need to calm down. But I saw someone talk about spraying their asshole too, and it was a guy, and I just I was like, you know what? Just still close that shit, but you know, I, well, congratulations for being the first guy I've seen do that. You're fucking irresistible, sunshine. I literally proposed to Sterling this what was it today? I'm pretty sure today. Yo, but the things I want to do to you. Sterling! Sterling is right here! Calm the fuck down. Jesus Christ. My man is right there and he does not give a fuck. Sterling is just like, nah, it's fine. I don't... He's already drunk. Maybe that's why he hasn't said anything. He's already drunk as hell. I'm sorry. I was thinking about um, other things like that fan fiction I was writing. Not, it's not even fan fiction. It's literally my shit. Oh, hey. Huh. When I was writing that, that thing with Yuri and Kage, it was going to be, it, it was supposed to be, I'll sum it up very shortly. It was basically, he got jealous of her training very closely with Apollo, and Apollo got pretty handsy because, you know, they were, they, both of them were flirting and stuff. And Kage got jealous, so he decided to eat her out. Because he want he only wanted to hear her and he wanted her family to hear her too. <laughs> God damn it was Kenneth's birthday the other day and I didn't oh. I'm sorry, Kenneth. But yeah, that's what it was. Cause usually they hear him and her, but this time he said that he only wanted them to hear her. Yuri's family probably does not get probably does not they probably do not get any sleep because of Kage. <laughs> like they don't get no fucking sleep <laughs> Jesus Kage. yeah he he got very very jealous it, like and he he did he didn't even say anything he just instantly started kissing her like there was no explanation but Yuri could be, Yuri could put put together the pieces because he was acting like an asshole half the time, which more so than usual. I'm pretty sure Yuri's over brother <laughs> puss probably just gonna fucking move out. Like, no, we're over this bullshit. I want to sleep. Once I, ex once I make the farm bigger, Marcy's gonna be getting bitches pregnant. And I'm pretty sure that's the one that Jay named. <laughs> Here is family. What did we do to deserve it? Kage, everything. Like. Oh yeah, and I already said, I already, I already told y'all that he doesn't have like a normal tongue, right? He doesn't have like, and then he doesn't have like a normal, a completely normal mouth either. So, Yuri probably was thinking some things. 
that man's mouth probably open. She's like, Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> but then she saw the tongue and was like, oh. <laughs> I'm scared. But. <laughs> but. Kage Art is already beating Yuri. Now the fan has to deal with the fire. <laughs> Pick your poison, Yuri. You're either getting one, like... You're getting. You're either getting beat. You're either getting beat by this dick, or you're getting beat by these fists. You're gonna make me start thinking something. <laughs> I just woke up. I just woke because I, I took a. I took a quick nap and I woke up. I was like, huh. I want to write this one thing. I'm gonna keep this star. I'm gonna keep this so I can make seeds with it later. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to be selling these. I could probably sell this back to him too. I did steal that from him. Yeah, cause I can. I can just make that. Pick your poison. Get get beat or get, get beat or get bit. <laughs> I just couldn't stop. No, I just couldn't stop imagining Yuri being like, "Oh shit, Kage, Kage, what the fuck?" Or being completely horrified. But then she sees his tongue and she's like, "Oh, wait a minute, huh?" <laughs> I'm I'm scared, but I'm also curious. <laughs> I'm gonna sell you everything. Everything that I totally did not steal back from you. That's that take all this. Oh wait, did I did I meant the melons? It's fine. It's fine. I I still have melons growing on my farm. I hope they'll finish by the time the thing. This is the most exciting time of my life. The weight is killing me. Yeah, he's just excited for us getting married. Man, now I kind of want to draw that. Like Kage's face between her thighs and Kiri looking horrified. And then he opens his mouth and she sees his tongue. And she's like, oh. <laughs> um, now I'm slightly more relaxed. Fucking Kage- oh my god, Kage turning Yuri into a monster fucker. <laughs> yeah, cause he's te- yeah, cause he- that technically- that technically would be monster fucking, wouldn't it? Yeah. And then, the, the, oh my god, then the next time she sees Apollo, Paul, like, oh shit, what happened to you? Like, uh, it, it, not, you know, Kage, when I went home, me and Kage were training, and, you know, he was, yeah. Okay, you were training, so why do you have, like, you have marks on your thighs? No, that's nothing. What do you mean? Hello there. I'm pretty sure I've already been through this. But I want to show you why I just don't like him, because it's one fucking scene. My dad and I are just testing some soil samples. Don't be shy, we could use a hand, actually. Could you watch this beaker for me? I'm gonna grab the last batch of samples. I'll be right back. Thanks for helping out, Puddles. They need to seriously fit his eye his eyes just have no glow in them. Mari's a good Mari's a good kid. She's my special little girl. I wouldn't want anything getting in the way of her bright future, you know what I mean? Demetrius, I'm getting fucking married. What the fuck are you talking about? I'm literally getting married. Just some food for thought, chuckle. Demetrius, I'm literally getting married. I don't want your daughter. What the fuck? I don't want your daughter. I literally have a man. And I also want Nora. Hey, sorry about that. I hope you found something to talk about while I was gone. I'm calling his bitch ass out. I was just telling Puddles about the soil samples we were testing. No the fuck you weren't, you lying bitch. Right, Puddles? Your dad was being weird. Sigh. Get pissed off, bitch. 
Huh? What did you say to her, Dad? Okay, okay. We were talking about you, sweetie. No, we weren't. You were talking about her. I was just over here trying to figure out what this, <laughs> the different types of soil. I don't fucking know. <laughs> I want to say a few things to Puddles about you, but I didn't want to embarrass you. I shouldn't have lied about it. That's okay, Dad. I understand. No, that's not okay. We should get back to work before these samples crystallize. What the hell? I can't stand that, dude. I can imagine Yuri getting annoyed, but <laughs> relieved Kage wasn't <laughs> beating her night. <laughs> her thinking they're about to fight, but Kage fucking opens his mouth and she's like, oh, wait. Oh yeah, I could go on and up. Oh, I'll do that later. Cause I want to get this shit done. I'm gonna put my horse. I don't want to block that, but maybe I will. I could put it over here. I wanted to put it kind of close. Uh, we'll put it right here for now. I can move it later. I just heard some guy on a show said say i was just in america a land of many potent erections and i can't fucking breathe right send <laughs> wait so we just what does he mean we're just all hard are we just constantly hard what where's my dick at <laughs> i mean is he is that a good thing <laughs> Thank, thanks, random guy. We are, we do have very big erections. My dingling is massive. Okay. I want to go flirt with the wizard. I mean, go be nice to the wizard. I don't know, but the man was dead serious. <laughs> we can, I guess we all, I guess we just all got big dicks. I don't know. I guess we're all just constantly hard. I'm hard right now. <laughs> Wait, is it, maybe he went somewhere where there's like a bunch of people wearing sweatpants. Man, where's that guy going? <laughs> like, man, where are you going in America? I don't be seeing no erections. But I also don't be looking, so... That was, you know, probably that. So did I buy this fucking milk, this thing for nothing? I'm gonna throw it in here. Um, I guess I could go, I, I could go to the mines for a little bit. Gosh damn it, yeah, because I need to get some more iron. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh my god, that's actually cute. Grows mushrooms everywhere so often. More wild trees are nearby. Better it works. Oh my god, I need that. Let me... I'm a be... I don't know what I'm just gonna slap it down. And this, I had to put this near some wild trees, so I guess over here, where I haven't cut down many, I'll put them over here. Put one here, and I guess I'll put you over here. There's three trees over there, that should be enough. There we go. The man is British, so odds are he meant something else, but it made me look... <laughs> oh. Yeah, you probably meant something else. But <laughs> Yuri's family, do you know what it's like to have Kage fuck your loved one? Apollo, I literally had to deal with that guy fucking my kin, and you don't need to see me complaining. <laughs> he's like, he's like, it's like at least you get at least like one or two days to sleep when fucking Kage is over at my house fucking my <laughs> fucking my elemental kin. He's over here fucking the shit out of soul. 
fucking the soul out of soul. It's like, you don't see me fucking complaining. <laughs> and I'm just imagining Apollo trying to sleep, and he just hears the fucking bed creaking. <laughs> Being like, oh my fucking god. I hate it here. Oh god, and then him having to explain that to like his mom or someone in his family, but he doesn't want to get, he doesn't want to let them know that he's allowing, he doesn't want to let anyone know that he's allowing fucking Kage into their, into their house. Cause you know, their families don't really like each other. And he doesn't want to, you know, get Yuri in trouble or whatever. <laughs> he's like, the only reason I'm letting you fuck Soul is because I do not want Yuri to get in trouble for you being over here and not with her. I know she can't fucking control you. But god damn it, can you control yourself? <laughs> oh, you little shit. Get out of here. I don't want to fight fucking ghost. You little bitch. Get out of here. I want iron. Move, bitch. <laughs> Kage letting me. <laughs> Like, you're fucking, you think you're letting me do that shit? <laughs> you think you could stop me? <laughs> the fact that you think you could stop me is hilarious. <laughs> like, I don't give a fuck who knows what I'm doing. <laughs> Kaki just being the fucking the fucking menace. I love it. I love the mind music. I... Now, I'm just a, now I just want to imagine, now I'm just low-key imagining Solus doing the fucking, the walk of shame next time he sees, next time he sees, um, Apollo. He's just very, very quiet. Or he's trying to talk about literally anything else except Kage, because he knows Apollo would question him. I'm like, oh, so did you have fun? So before he even would say anything after the next day, he would just start rambling over some bullshit like oh yeah we should tell you like i want to show you this new training thing that i saw some other people doing we should try that I'm like oh yeah did you hear about what happened <laughs> what happened with this one person yeah it was crazy just doing everything in his power to keep him from mentioning it all the while still having fucking marks on him Oh my god, go away. Go away, you bitch. Get. Get. I'm pretty sure the wizard likes these things. I should give them to them. Or, I wonder if he likes the bat wings. Maybe I should give him the bat wings. Oh god, I don't want to fight all these bitches. It'd be good to level up my... Oh, wait, no, there's diamonds over there. I need that. Apollo's mom is so okay. I heard him crying. <laughs> well, he, he was training. Like, yeah, I heard him crying a lot last night. Crying and groaning and stuff. Is he, is he okay? Yeah. He's, he's fine. He was... Training real hard. <laughs> like maybe you should let up on training. Yeah, I'll I'll talk to him about not training is fucking hard or is it or is loud at night. I apologize. 
my god, get out of here, little bitch. And don't forget, we still need to go to my mom's house tonight, James. So I'm glad you had a chance to sleep a little bit. Because I want my children. Ooh. Please be more powerful than this bitch that I have here. Well, it's not more po Well, it has a lot of... Uh, I'll, I'll keep it. I'll keep it for now. Uh, let me... I'll go on. I'll go... I'll look at one floor. Oh, yeah. I do need more copper. Hey, little bitch. Now we can leave the mines. I'll leave these bombs here. I have so much food, so I'm just leaving here. And I'm going to continue leaving food here. Except this. I need this. I need anything else. No. Yeah, so now we can go. Oh my god! Quiet night, huh? I wonder if if Marloon and Jean found something scrungy. No. Do you remember when I was when I was? Do you remember when I was first outside, Gil, and you brought me in? You found me in a trash can. I was hungry a lot when I was outside. Whenever you fed me, I didn't want to eat it all right away. I thought, what if you never come back and feed me again? No. Not the sad anime backstory. I'll keep feeding you, Jorts. I know. I trust you and Marlon and Jean. You're my family. But feelings are feelings are slow to change. Sometimes they're not... Sometimes they're not sure, even when our thoughts are. They'll get there, though. As long as I keep reminding myself. Wait. The baby. Smart cat. Hehe. <laughs> I just have a lot of time to think about things. I hope you have... I hope you always have enough of everything, Kill. Now, good night. The baby! I'm gonna fucking... With... Uh, that's sweet, baby. I'm sad. Baby, this a baby. He just drops some knowledge and just bounces. It's like, here's some important knowledge and it leaves. If Gil dies, I'm fucking crying. <laughs> Don't worry, no one, in, no one in this town dies except maybe Ellie. <laughs> But we all, <laughs> if Gil and Maroon, oh my god, if Gil and Maroon dies, Merlone dies, I would, I, I would just, I would delete this game. <laughs> if anything happens to those cats, I'm deleting this fucking game. <laughs> I don't care if it's a mod, I'm deleting the whole game. I'm pretending I never, I'm just gonna pretend that this game never happened. Apollo's mom, are you okay? So I heard you groaning, Apollo, yeah, I'm fine. You know, just working real hard at night. I'm gonna keep this. I guess I can give that to, to Sebastian. And I need these two things. But I never... Uh, this, is, this is why I like playing. I like playing Stardew. I've never seen that, that cutscene. Cause like, I I stopped playing it for a very long time. And then I then whenever I do decide to play, it's usually after an update. Then I have to restart everything. Oh hell yeah! Now, now I can make 
alcohol with my keg. Now we should I should go fit I should go fish. Give those bait give my give Jort some fish. Y'all know anything about this AFK journey? No, I have not. I see it around a lot, but I have not. I have not touched it. Wait, I'm supposed to be getting married today, I think. It's gonna rain all day tomorrow, so yeah, I think it's, yeah, I think this is supposed to be. Fuck. But yeah, I haven't played it. But I've seen it around. I'm considering to try. I mean, I say go for it. It looks like a decent game. I'm gonna... Oh my god. I'm not giving you any of my fucking melons. I need them. Peach jelly and hot pepper jelly. I'm gonna keep the pepper one and sell the peach one. Oh yeah, I need to remember to touch my animals. Oh my god, one of my things got zapped the other day. Little bitch. I'm gonna dump this here so I don't have to keep running to Pierre. And yes, Jen, I'm going to give you some water. I see you. I see you and I notice you. Never heard of it. You haven't heard of it? That's uh, that's the only ad I've been getting. Now me talking about it, I'm going to get that ad again. Oh, play AFK. Play AFK. Don't they have, like, titty jiggle phys physics on there or something? Or is that another game? Because when I saw it, I'm pretty sure that's what I saw and I was like... Oh, so that's why they're advertising it towards me. I like the art style. Yeah, the art style is pretty cute. Titties, you say? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I saw some titties in there. Well, God damn it! my thing is, I need to fix my fence. So my chickies will stay over here and not wander all over everywhere that I won't be able to find them. Going update. I want to upgrade this farm. I want to get the self feeder thing, and I want to get have more than just what's it called chickens. Going to get the rabbits and the ducks and stuff. Did I already give? Yeah, I already did. Had to make sure. Oh, wait, let me go in and build those fences. Fix those fences. But this motherfucker is here. I mean, I could. I, I could make it so she does it in like a. She does it, she builds it instantly, but. I feel like the weight makes it a little better. Oh, I gotta fix those fences too. Now, 
let's go into town and see what the town has to do. That well, I know we're supposed to be fishing today, so I guess I should grab my pole. Let's go check that out because I I think I'm pretty sure this is new to the base game. And I'm a teeny bit curious, and I need to go on. I need to seriously go on and make a pathway. I bought the pathways, and I need to go on. So when is there going to be a baby? I mean, I'm getting married to Sterling, so there should be one soon. Well, not soon. It's going to be a minute. In Stardew, it takes a minute to have a child. What the hell? Fishing sisters. We're famous fishing sisters. I will push you both into the water. Hi, Luna. I'm really enjoying this season's warm air puddles. Is it not? Why don't you go find Abigail? Oh my god, there's so many fishing people. Fishing pro. I know it's not competition, but still. Whoever gets the most tags will have bragging rights for the rest of the year. Fisherman. Ah, oh, this is a life. Nothing more than tra the, tranquil the tranquility fuck, than, a, than a day of than a day of trout fishing. I'm a little tired. Leave me alone. <laughs> Any luck? Most of the bites they're getting are from mosquitoes. Oh god, I love fishing, but mosquitoes be killing me. Trout man. Where I come from, they call me Trout Man. Okay. Uh, okay. Of course, of course, of course some guy shows up wearing the same outfit as me. How embarrassing. I think I'm a little overdressed for this event. I came all the way from Grappleton for this. Nor, you have anything to say about this? I just had the craziest nightmare last night. There was a bald guy following me around. He proposed to me out of nowhere. What? Then, when I said no, a thousand clones of him showed up and trapped me. I think I saw a giant head somewhere, too. Ugh, I need some- I need coffee. No, you don't. You don't need any more fucking coffee. During this event, Rainbow Trail have a chance of carrying a golden tag. If you find one, turn it in here for a prize. Oh. Now I kind of want to... I want to... Wait, let me see... Oh, well. Fuck. Oh, shit, I got one. Wait, let me see what the fucking rewards are first. You received a tent kit. What? Use this to ploy. One time you stand for sleeping. Can only be used outdoors. Oh, that's actually cool. Concerned ape, you spoil us, I swear. That's actually really cool. Oh shit, Willy! It's a big day, I got all my equipment turned into- I got my, all my equipment tuned, uh, tuned to catch drought. Good luck out there. I'm not gonna be fishing today, Willy. I wanna go see my man. Oh, hi Lucille. I'm kind of- oh yeah, I need to- I need to give you some things. Give you some things so they can finally stop saying- repeating the same thing over and over and over again. Shane. Hi, Shane. Have you tried the new Joja Bablito? I ate two in one sitting yesterday. That was a mistake. Well, at least you're not trying to get into my pants. Maybe it's maybe it's getting around that I'm about to marry Sterling. Young Coraline is like a granddaughter to me. I'm glad I'm glad she and Yessa are good friends. Have you met them? You might see them walking together on occasion. They were particularly joined at the hip when they were little. Aww. And they were roommates. Hi, Sterling. When, it, when are we going to get married? The weight is killing me as well. Is it just me, or does Abigail look a little pale? Maybe I'm just worrying about her too much. Caroline, Caroline, you look a little pale. It's probably just fucking genetics. I'm going to try to write MK headcans. I have not safe work on the mind. I have to write, I want to write them down. Do it. Do it. <laughs> good friends, yeah. Good good old fashioned buddies. 
Haley, Haley is staring at you with an odd expression. She looks stuck in a daze. She doesn't seem to realize that you caught her staring. She seems too immersed in her thoughts to notice. It's starting to freak you out. Jesus. Here, do you want this? Gas for me? Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome, Haley. Oh, no. Do it. Do it, Jay. I dare you. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> I was going to make some more head cannons. I just... When something gets popular, when something gets really popular, I kind of lose a little bit of interest in it. Because no matter what, whenever I go and look for Raiden and stuff, all I see is young Raiden. And it's that's fine. I love young Raiden. He's adorable. That's not the bitch I'm looking for. <laughs> but I have been seeing some new older Raiden ones, too. Not a whole lot, but a good amount to where I'd say, you know what? Maybe you're not so bad, <laughs> young Raiden, because you're making people realize that older Raiden is just as good. Been putting food out for water for a stray cat near the beach. She's been abandoned. She oh, damn. She's been abandoned, poor girl. Ellie's determined to befriend her. Here. I'm determined to befriend you. These are so... These are... Sweet peas are such great gifts to give people. And that's why I spam people with them. I want to go back to where the demon the demon goats are. Guys, I got bad news. Oh my god, did you get stabbed again? Please tell me you didn't get stabbed again. Please tell me that the bad news is not that you're harmed. Again, <laughs> again, they they get they get, they've been stabbed twice. <laughs> Kitty, oh my god, did you get fucking stabbed? What the fuck? Who's stabbing you? First it was a 14 year old, then it was yourself. The <laughs> What did I tell you? Jay Lily came back yesterday to tell you, hey, yeah, don't get stabbed again. And going to like, again? <laughs> They've been stabbed again? That's what it's starting to seem like. Now we're all just, like, disappointed parents. God damn it. You got stabbed again. God damn it, kitty. How did this happen? <laughs> How... We need to keep you wrapped in bubble wrap or something. Or it puts you in just full-on armor. It was me again. I stabbed myself right in the center of my hand. Were you cutting watermelon again? <laughs> We're gonna keep you away from knives. It's so easy for people. I never... I I think I've only cut myself like once, and I've and I've I've had a knife run across my hand several times before. Not like purposely, but me trying to cut something and then the knife brushes against my hand. Like when I'm cutting onions or when I'm cutting peppers, it happens. But I haven't like don't often cut myself. I don't. I, I don't understand, and I'm not sure if I want to. I think I like my skin being whatever the fuck my skin is. Oh, yeah, this, so this is the farm. This is the farm that um, I can build other things. Oh, so I could I could build. I could have what's it called? Other cows up here. Cows and chickens and a lot of other things. Hell, oh, 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 there, broken boy, Bob, and now you're now and now you're throwing rocks. Kit, but Kitty, were you Kitty? 
Sorry, kid, kid, kitty. Did you get stabbed? Oh, we could make it even. I love these goats. I just love the way they look. There's something weird about them, but I, I love them. Uh, I don't want to walk all the way back. Wait, isn't there a way up here? I'm pretty sure, but I'm also not pretty sure. Oh wait, no, there's not. Or maybe there is. I mean, I could use my, my sleeping thing. Oh my god, move, you little shit. You little bastard. Tiny goat bastard. There's, maybe, maybe there's not a way up here anymore. I mean, I can sleep out here. I'll do it. Where's my tent? I'm doing it. Yay. Oh, fuck. How, can I, how, do I get, how do I use this thing? Oh, God. Did I put it in the wrong thing? <sighs> Never again. Be nice to goats. Goats will beat your ass in real life, but yeah, be nice to goats. Oh, hi, Sir Lagolot. Because the bar is low. Good night. I'll see myself. <laughs> Am I in limbo, boat, Sir Lagolot? <laughs> Why are you here this whole time? It's not a cast, but I like, but I like to... It's not a cast, but like I don't know how to describe it. The, fi the finger thingy? Leave the goats alone. Oh, my God. I will... Sl Yar, I will just to be. Yeah, don't make me do something out of spite. Don't make me do something out of spite. I will go and I will get my butcher thing and I will butcher. I will butcher a cow. I need meat anyway, so I could finish the community bundle. And I was gonna wait, but I will. I will eat one of the cows. But goats are fucking- goats will fuck you up in real life. Ah, shit. This is another reason why I didn't want to come over here at night. Where's my cake? I took the cake away because it was low-key annoying. I didn't realize how annoying the cake was until, what's it called? I turned my, I didn't know there was like sound. Oh, hi, Sterling. You're gonna be walking back to my house soon enough. But yeah, I'll turn it back on once my, once around my birthday. You assume I can't find more ways to be annoying? I know you will, but I'm gonna remove the cake. <laughs> And I'm pretty sure Jay agreed with me that the, the cake was indeed annoying. But I'm gonna probably have the cake come back on my birthday or on a, on special occasions you will have cake. I will only have something show up multiple times when it's like, when does I become an affiliate and I can y'all can actually use bits because you can't use bits because I'm not an affiliate. Uh, we'll throw that, 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 that. Uh, I don't know how quick these, oh shit, no. I don't know how quick these bitches are gonna grow, but I'm just gonna throw them down just in case. Okay, no, go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep. Cause I do not want to, see those are, those are less annoying to me, cause it's not like, happy hearing happy birthday happy birthday constantly i can deal with the darts i cannot deal with the cake not the finger thing because it's like by my knuckle luckily i didn't fuck anything up too much so i didn't lose complete motion of my hand but i can't move it too much 
Yo, this thing has this thing has <laughs> happened to me all my life. I'm so accident prone help. Be more careful. Jesus, dodging me. I'm not dodging you, I'm just trying to sleep. <laughs> Yay, now I can get married. When Pearls first arrived at Pelican Town, no one knew she would fit into our community. Damn. <laughs> But from this day forward, Puddles is going to be as much as part of the town as anyone else, as any of us, whatever. It is an honor on this day of the 21st of summer to unite Puddles and Sterling in the bonds of marriage. Well, let's get right to it. Why can't I wear a dress or something? Puddles, Sterling, as mayor of Pelican Town, and the bearer, and the bearer of, let's see, what it, fuck ever. I now pronounce you wife and husband. You may now kiss. Where the fuck is everybody else? I want the whole town here. Oh my god. What are the what are the yonderies? The yonder <laughs> the yonderies are not moving at all. They're gonna fucking kill me. Jesus kitty. Like my legs been run over by a car. Oh nice. <laughs> Jesus Christ. We, okay. But the future looks bright. Kitty, you may just need to just stop going outside. Yay! Wait, where did I get that money? Oh yeah, that money's from that. Oh yeah, I forgot I have the kissing mod. I can kiss him as much as I want now. My horse! I kind of don't trust y'all to name the horse. <laughs> I kind of don't trust y'all to name the horse. <laughs> what do y'all want to name? What do y'all want to name the horse? I'm thinking Raiden. I'm thinking Raiden because then I can... <laughs> I'm thinking I'm going to do Raiden. I was thinking Leroy. You know what's funny? I have a horse. I actually named another one of my horses Leroy. Was, or Leroy. Wait, I have, I'm pretty sure that's Leroy. Name the horse Goofy. No. It's being Raiden. Because I want to be able to ride him. Whenever I want. Damn. I forgot how fast horses are. See, isn't it much better? Isn't it much better now you don't have to sit there and listen to Happy Birthday constantly? Because y'all spammed the cake. Y'all spammed the cake too much. Now I gotta fix my fences, oh god. Now you're just gonna spam everything else. But hey, I'll deal with the light noise over the... Jesus Christ. I'm about to replace all these fences, huh? You took away my you took away my cake and my bras. Now I'm mildly peeved. You're a 17 year old boy. The last thing I wanted was you throwing bras at me. That's weird. Even if it's just, it, even if it's just like a fucking little what's it called a thing. No matter how I no matter how you I cut it I cut that. Why is there a child here? Kitty is also a child. 
But that's why I got rid of the brawn panties. I didn't feel comfortable anymore. God damn it, I need to... God damn it. Oh, I did not mean to... Oh, well, well. I guess I did. I, it's too late now. Penny, I can't believe that a harlot married... <laughs> I can't believe that Harley Mary or Marley were alone, Penny. <laughs> it's just weird, Bob. Kitty isn't spamming bras. Yeah, but fucking, what's his face? Bob was doing it, and that's why I got rid of the bras. Maybe when I, when I get bits, when I get bits, then I'll feel comfortable, because then... Children don't usually have money, and if when they do, they usually don't want to spend on things like that. And if they still do, I'll be so concerned. I, the, I'd be so concerned. I'd make the bras a certain price. I don't have money. <laughs> that sounds like a <laughs> problem. That sounds like a you problem. I also don't have money. But if you really want to harass me, then uh, I'll be, I'll unlock more things. I'll unlock even more things. So then you can harass me and just see me in pain. It looks like, it looks, did you marry that Sebastian fellow? Not in this game, but in another game, yes. I don't eat meat because mostly, because it mostly tastes gross and I don't like eating innocent animals, but I don't care if you do. Except chicken. Chickens go to <laughs> I I only like I like I like beef. I like beef and I like certain I like certain types of if you cook the chicken a certain type of way then I'll probably eat it. But I'm very picky with when it comes to eating meat. I'm extremely picky. Which is sometimes I just don't eat it because it's just not worth the hassle. James knows that. No, I have money. Close the fence, oh my god. No, I'm not closing the fence. The chickens aren't gonna leave. Chickens are fine. They're fine. Also, fuck seafood. I also am picky with seafood. But I hate- I don't like shrimp, and I don't like crab, and it makes me sad that I don't like those things, because it looks fun to eat. It looks fun cracking open a crab and eating it. And a lobster, but I just don't like them, so I just- uh, I just can't. It makes me sad. I want to enjoy- I want to enjoy those foods. Will you say anything to me in my house? No, he'll just kiss me. Okay. I will eat chicken nuggets when I get some. Oh yeah, I love- oh yeah, chicken nuggets are amazing. This is this gonna be our anniversary forever? That's amazing. That's amazing and it's cute, that is true. That shit sucks, I don't care what you think. I don't eat any type of animal flesh except fish and seafood. I like basic fish, basic fried or grilled fish. Do you ever get the urge to go exploring puddles? That's what I do every day. Okay, pretend you just want a free vacation. Where would you go? I'm pretty sure none of this matters. Uh, I'm pretty sure it doesn't really matter. We'll just... I'll go, I'll say that. Yeah, that sounds like wonderful. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it doesn't matter. You're doing a fantastic job. I'm sitting like a shrimp right now. 
I wonder if I wonder if he's gonna keep working. The spell the smell physically makes me gag. Oh yeah, that makes sense. That that does make sense. Fish does smell awful. I'm gonna steal these. What the hell? Graphite and action to dry them. Oh, that's cool. I can't, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna gift these flowers to some people. I know Haley loves them. Where's Haley? Oh, she's gonna go down there to Alex. This isn't like a shrimp right now. I don't recognize what. You, oh no, you're we're doing even better. Amazing. I'm fucking up my posture. <laughs> I need to retry fish stick. I ate them up when I was younger. I fish sticks are I love fish sticks. Oh, cute little cute little puddles has been talking to other people lately. Oh my god, she was at my wedding. Oh my god, fush fish sticks. I hate those bitches. Oh my god, I love fish sticks. They're delicious. Bro, they suck ass. I love fish sticks. You can hate them all you want, but I love them. Oh my god! <laughs> She better stop soon, or else I might I might have to get my hands dirty. Haley, I brought you a flower. I don't think that I don't think that'd make anyone happy, now would it? Besides me, of course. I just wanted to give you a flower. <laughs> wow, these are beautiful. <laughs> You're missing your favorite shirt? Man, that must suck. Do you have any idea where it went? Did you take my shirt? Well, I hope you find it soon. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Lucille, don't leave. He just instantly left. He instantly left. He instantly left. He heard that shit. He's like, nah, I ain't got time for that bullshit. Oh my God. You're not gonna kill me. You're not gonna kill me. It's a boring reaction because I know you won't kill me. Don't you have work to do, bitch? My work is you. <laughs> She's gonna kill my man. She's gonna kill my husband. Oh my god, I need to talk to everyone today. They're gonna fucking <laughs> Look, I have to I have to plead my case for Sterling. <laughs> I have to plead my case. Look, please don't kill my man. <laughs> <laughs> Please, for the love of God. Where where is everyone today? Elliot Elliot is at the beach. I'm gonna go see him. The demon is not having the shit. <laughs> he really said, Nope, I am not dealing with that shit. Oh yeah, I already seen this. I don't wanna do it. I don't wanna do it. She scares me. When you see hot air balloon, well, that's yeah, that's not really helpful. Hi there, miss. Y'all motherfuckers don't have anything important to say. I hope I hope I can get it married. Sigh. I hope I can get married someday. You really don't want to get married someday. Here, do you want this, Vincent? Lewis. Congratulations, Puddles. This is a big step forward for you and Sterling. You really have grown some roots in this town. Yeah. It's a big step, and it's probably a very dangerous step. I, maybe I shouldn't talk to him on over here. Maybe what if, what if he just drags me off? Have you ever wondered what the other side of the gym sea is like? I know there's a Fern Islands, but I'm talking about further afield. It must be a flat and silent there, devoid of even the sound of wind. I'd love to go there with you. He's talking about murder. He's talking about murder. He's talking, he's gonna murder me. He wants us both to go together and that's not a good thing. What murder mod, bro, please? Just look up yandere mod. What, not murder, you might, just look up yandere mod. Look up yandere mod. Stardew Valley yandere mod, it's not hard. <laughs> There's a lot of them. If you don't do that, Sterling might end up like Susie. 
You basically, Jolene, except you're trying to keep people from killing your man. <laughs> Please don't kill my man. <laughs> Where's Penny? I'm so scared for that man. He's just trying to live life. I'm just like, I just wanted to befriend people. Oh yeah, let me talk to Leah. Just like, please. Please let my man go free. Don't kill him. Oh, look at her out here drawing. She's probably drawing Sterling getting murdered. Oh, you're still talking about, you're wondering how he can swim. You're, she's probably, I don't know. There, there's definitely something going on there. Okay, I gotta go. I gotta take the fucking antibox that costs a fucking shit ton. What the fuck, CVS? Anyways, bye. Bye, kitty. Stop getting hurt. Stop getting stabbed. Stop getting hit by cars. And just, just stop. <laughs> can S Sterling swim, Teehee? I think he can. I'm pretty sure he mentioned something about being able to swim. Which he's probably gonna need it. Where the fuck is Penny? Is she is she teaching the kids today? I don't think she. You know, today's Sunday. Penny, you're all the way up there. Oh, hi, Caroline. Today I'm going to relax and think positively. I also need to relax and think positively, but I shall not because life is spicy. I'm begging you, please take <laughs> Please take my man. Puddles trying to keep the Yandere's from killing Sterling. Please don't take my man. Hi, Penny. Puddles, what do you... Puddles, what do you think? Should a person be judged by their actions or by their intentions? I was just wondering what you thought. What do y'all think? <laughs> One, two, or three. One, two, or three. I'm, I don't know how this is going to turn out. Bye, Kitty, for fuck's sake, stay away from knives. Let's hope Kitty stays away from knives and weapons in general. I'm going to vacuum more because of you, Joey. Their actions can affect how you feel. and welcome it. It makes it easier to ignore their intentions. Sometimes three. I need like a. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna choose three. We're gonna choose three. That's true. I guess it doesn't it doesn't have to be one or the other. It might depend on the situation too. Yeah. Just please don't kill my man. Thank you. This looks special. Yeah. Please don't kill my man. It's, those are don't kill my man flowers. Hey, lady that I have not spoken to. I'm pretty sure you're Maddie. Not bad. Thank you. Today is the only day that I get to be free, bitch. I know it's the only day you're ever free. You, no, you said that every fucking day. You said that the other day, too. Let me go talk to Sebastian. Maybe he'll... Maybe he'll... Be sane enough to not... Try to murder my man. I think the mod doesn't work for him. The Yandere mod. Because I tried putting it in. <laughs> and that's what she said. But, yeah, it didn't work. I usually only go outside after dark. Does that sound weird to you? No, the sun hurts, so it makes sense. Wait, Linus, are you up here? You should be up here, right? Okay, so then he's over here then. Unless he's fishing today. Linus. Where are you, Linus? Linus, I want to give you food. I think this is the area that I was talking about. I wonder if it's still over here. I don't think it is. No, it is. It is over here. Oh, it was just in a different area. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Okay. 
magic. What time is it? I'm gonna go on and end the stream once once I get back home and end the stream. I gotta go grab my cats. I was supposed to do it yesterday, but me and James honestly both forgot. Because once I ended the stream, I instantly started playing Coral Island and my brain went turned off. And I miss my kids. can't leave you. I haven't complimented you enough for your wonderfulness, if that's a word. I wonder if that's a word. I'm not sure if that's a word, but if it's a word, you can make it a word. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try working on those MK headcans. Good night. Good night, Jay. And good night, everyone. Hope you all have a wonderful night. I am going to go grab my kids and hopefully have them tomorrow. James. James. I'm in the stream. I'm in the stream. Okay, later. Keep it radical. <laughs> good, 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 good night, everyone.